What's going on, guys? Am I having trouble bringing Discord up so I can send an alert? Nice wallpaper. I like it a lot, too. There we go. How is everyone tonight? You guys, are you guys ready for more of this chore? I'm, I've kind of arrived at the point where I consider this game a bit of a chore. So much so that I was actually preparing for today's stream by leveling off, scre off screen. I literally just w took like two hours earlier today to level up in this game by grinding out some levels so I didn't have to do it on stream. So hopefully, I, well, I'm still technically under leveled, but... Ugh, not quite as bad. <laughs> yeah, that EA press conference, how about that? What a great event. I really see why it was necessary. Have you guys seen my uh, research stream announcement on YouTube? Is that showing up for anyone yet? For me, it's not showing anything when I check on it. You know, it might help if I close out of that. I don't really need that open. I want to eat up some stuff. You guys didn't see it either. Yeah, it's some, YouTube's doing being weird at the moment. I just uploaded and it's not showing up. Okay, some people are seeing it and some people aren't. Yeah, that's a sloth. My spirit animal, essentially. This is my background. I have to use display capture with this game because if I use game capture, it gets really funky. We'll get started in just a minute, guys. I'm just waiting for this. You Why does the... I'm guessing it's probably gone through. It's just YouTube is being a dick and not currently showing into my list of videos. I've done this before. Yeah, some people are seeing it. I'm not. It'll eventually show up. We're good. So how is everyone out tonight? I'd, I'm not, I'm not going to promise yet that we'll beat this game, but I'm going to give it a college try. I did some I did some leveling off stream, so I'm at level 20 now. Last night I ended off at level 15. Earlier today I went and did a bunch of like crappy side missions. Don't worry, you didn't miss anything. I didn't eat anyone, but I did like heal up a bunch of people, do some boring side missions, and I got up like five extra levels. I still probably need to start the stream off by eating someone though, to get where I really need to be. Yeah, it's, the video's showing up, it just isn't not notifying people. It, YouTube is weird sometimes with really short videos. No idea why. <coughs> Go ahead and get into the game, actually. So we can get the violin music out of the way. I was riveted by the EA conference. I especially like the part with the Madden NFL champion guy. I was touched. That was a story I feel that we all really needed to hear. We'll just pause that for a second. Yep, I told you I was going to name tonight's stream Vegan Vampire. Well, I think it was re recommended to be Vegetarian Vampire. Ironic, since we're going to start the stream off by ending our veganism and eating a person, too. So it's not really going to be accurate for very long. Someone wished on... Yeah, we got the new Command and Conquer. That that kind of deserves... I believe any time a, a, a 
a storied franchise gets a mobile game, it needs to have an asterisk by its name. So it's like, here's a new entry into the Command and Conquer game. Asterisks. Mobile version. Soul Reaver, how are you? What is this game about? Vampires. Vampires and London. I think that you can actually just call this game Vampires in London, and it works perfectly. Well, our sister's storyline is now over. She came back from the dead and we killed her again. Kind of anticlimactic when you think about it. All right, we're going to go ahead and get started now. We're at like 50 people watching. That seems good enough for me. So, let me show you the current state of affairs. I have gotten our main character here, Vampire Coon, up to level 20. I also leveled the hell out of his sword. His sword is almost max level now, as is his stake, so they actually do some pretty decent damage. I leveled up a couple of his abilities. Mainly his health and stamina, all that good stuff. And I basically went back to Whitechapel and cured almost every one of every disease that I could actually cure. And did a bunch of side quests that were really not very interesting at all. And you pro you really shouldn't worry about missing them at all. I am paying attention to everyone in the chat, Mystic. I'm just explaining what's going on. But I'm pretty sure we're still under leveled, even at level 20. Because I'm still running into enemies that are like 23 and 25. So I believe we're going to have to eat someone in the hospital here tonight to get us up to where we need to be. So we need to decide who that's going to be. The hospital is really the only place I can really eat someone from. I could probably eat someone from Whitechapel too since they're at 76% now. Yeah, I can't just pay attention to one guy in particular in Chat Mystic. So let's look through who we got. Who's going to be our victim? It has to be... I, I can mes They have to be a level 3 mesmerize. So, and they also have to be worth a decent amount of experience. Okay, the Blood Lady's pretty decent. Well, she would be. <coughs> that guy's level four. He's probably, well, no, he's only like 960 XP. <coughs> These two still remain the best ones. I'm thinking I'm going to go after her because... He's a he sells stuff that I kind of like need to use, so and she's worth like twenty four hundred XP, so she's worth more than him too. Go out for some Chinese. Uh, no, there is a Chinese lady in Whitechapel. I could go out for Chinese. She's actually worth a pretty good amount. Actually, considering she doesn't have any connections, it might be best to eat her, since it won't affect anyone else. So we have our we have options of Shaoshun for this lady, I think. That should give you enough XP to give it get us to level level twenty one. Let me go buy some stuff from that dude first before I do anything else, because I think he has a part I need to get my gun up, my sword up to level what, max level? Hopefully. I'd rather. Do it here, cause that, the way it could, that way I can immediately move on to the next story mission, then run all the way to Whitechapel to eat someone. You have the part I need. Good evening, Milt. Good evening, Doctor. Still trying to save lives. I'd like to. I did a lot of the talking off screen today as well, so we don't have to worry about talking to any of these people in these current districts, except for the new district we're going to, which will have a whole new list, list of people to talk to. Good handle part. I need seventy dollars for that. Do I have anything to sell? Not enough that's going to get me to that. Hmm. They told me there were more of us with less resignation and more Perhaps determination. Perhaps I should the offer from their candidate fellow. Time to choose. Victim, we have to, we have to eat someone. Both her and her are both worth 2,400. She's maxed out though. I can't get her any higher because I failed one of her hints. She technically could go higher if I found out what the other two things are about her.
I wish I could just eat her, but she's level 5. If I, the, don't worry, if I get to the final mission of the game and it's too hard, I will just come back here and eat this entire hospital. I'm thinking, yeah, she might be best because she has no... Well, she's on... Yeah, I can eat someone in Whitechapel and not have it go. It'll just go to critical. She has no connections to anyone as well. So she's a really nice lady, though. She, like, helps the sick. So you, you guys sh sure you want me to eat this lady who just literally uses her wealth to heal the sick? EA's conference was a shit. I mispronounced that. I, I, I garbled that language just to make it sure you know that EA's conference was a shit. And this lady, the other lady, she sells, she like forces people to, you know, buy their way into the hospital, the sick. She's a much worse person. I'm going to eat her. Screw it. She's a terrible person. The other lady's really nice and sweet. And we've already saved your life once. I'm overruling the chat. Where's she at? There she is. Thank you for subbing, uh, Mediocrities the Sage. Thank you for that sub, dude. Make sure you use that those emotes you just bought. And tell us about yourself in chat, if you're not too shy. I need you to come with me. Wait a minute. Let me, let me see if I can unlock anything else about her first. Let me check her dialogue options. Good evening. <coughs> Wait, maybe get a little bit more experience. Evening, nope. I never got to her last two hints. All right. Once again, resume the position. Okay, where's a good place to murder you? How do you sub? Uh, you see the button up there that says subscribe? Subscribe? Just click on that. Subbing does cost money if you're not if you don't have Amazon Prime though, so keep that in mind. Yeah, you might be on the app, and I'm not sure how it looks on the app. So you have to let someone else in chat tell you that. <coughs> I'm the Harvest the Blood. <laughs> this is the first lady we've actually... We've gone a long time. I think we should be proud of our achievement. We've gone most of the game without having to do this, besides that one the, that freebie at the beginning of the game. There should be a button, uh, Estonia, somewhere that says uh, subscribe. I'm not sure where it will be on the app, though. Really? I ran out of magic juice? Come on. You talk. Turn around. Let me talk. Good evening, Nurse Hawkins. Good evening, Dr. Reed. We're almost to a place where I can eat you. Okay, you literally can't take her down there. That's why she's getting... Where can I eat her at, anyways? This is more complicated than Good it should evening, be. Nurse Hawkins. Good evening. When he puts his hand on her like that, he's mesmerizing her, so she'll follow him where he, wherever he wants. We have to find a place that's out of the way to drink her blood, though. If you go down to the docks in front of the, front of the place, I should be able to do it there. Well, he does it with his hands and, you know, by whispering in their ear. Different strokes for different folks. Is this good food? Uh, I've... Yeah, she's a decent amount of experience. It should be enough to get, get me to level 21. She's a terrible person, too. She, like, sells hospital beds to the poor.
embrace. Sorry. I knew I should have fled this rotten city with Milton since the first day of the contagion. I needed an extra level. Oh, the disc will be fine. What about the dude she's with? He's he's actually worth more than her. Well, he's he he's he's more valuable because he sells stuff. I'm hoping he doesn't run out of the place now that I've killed his girlfriend though. Like, oh, my lady friend's dead. Uh, you're good news. You're single. Good evening, Milton. Good evening, Doctor. Still trying to save lives. Your, your girlfriend's thinking of quitting. Do you know that Nurse Hawkins is thinking of leaving the hospital? That's not a surprise. We've talked In fact, about I think she already time. left. Does it not bother you? Sometimes I think she may be right. We should run away while we can. The question is, where can we go? Where is it safe? Can I go ahead and eat you? I don't know. I'd like to see your goods. Wise choice, Dr. Reed. A Hopefully he doesn't disappear after he finds out she's dead. Because I really need to buy that handle part from him. I need 20... Actually, I can probably go ahead and buy it now. No, that's only 17. Then sell something else, though. Oh, I can upgrade my sword to its final level. And then we'll go on to the main story mission. Okay, sword, we need you at max level. Need aluminum parts to get the second upgrade for it, but this thing is a beast now. 240 damage per attack. All right, let's see what happens now that we killed her. That's all right, Estonia. If, if you can, if you can, if you want to subscribe, but you can't for some reason the the mobile app is giving you problems. It's a lot easier to do it on uh, on a web browser, so when you get a chance to get onto an actual computer or something, just bring up my channel and you can find it there. Okay, what do we want? I think I want to upgrade my claws, if I can. Nope, that's 3,000 experience. Uh... I think it's so expensive. Who my ultimate? Oh uh, yeah, my ultimate. That does a lot of damage. That adds 120 extra damage to it. But let's see what else we got. Could also go with more health. These are all a pretty good level. I'm pretty satisfied with those. I think we'll do our ultimate. Okay, we're at level 21 now. Alright, let's see our consequences. Hopefully that guy doesn't run off and I'm not going to regret not killing him when I had the chance. That dropped it a little bit. He's fatigued now because his girlfriend died. That's about all. Some other people came down with fatigue. These doctors are always coming down with fatigue, I've noticed. Overworked they are. <laughs> Alright, he'll be the next person we eat here once we need to. 
but we're good for now. Time to go to the story mission. I think we're at a level where we can handle pretty much anything that's thrown at us. Have I seen any of the TV shows about hospitals? Yeah, they're pretty stressed out. Especially, I imagine, when they're working during a plague. Alright, to this place. So, down and across the bridge. Let's see what he says, though, before we leave. Oh shit, it's loading a lot. What do I think about Anthem? I'm not terribly interested. Okay, so this must be one hell of a conversation. Good evening, Milton. If you're here for the merchandise, you're out of luck. I've stopped selling. Far as I'm concerned. Thank God I bought that before he did that. This shit up. Why are you being so aggressive, Milton? I attended Pippa's funeral this afternoon. I was the only one from the hospital. So he stopped selling stuff after that. Will you keep extorting money from hospital patients now that your accomplice is dead? No, Dr. Reed. Now I know I did it for her. She thought for so long about fleeing the city. Even the country, maybe. What are you going to do then? No idea. To be honest, I don't even know why I still work here. I sure as hell don't plan on staying in this city forever. All right, so. He doesn't, he's not a merchant anymore, so he's next on the list to die. Goodbye, Milton. So, next time when I need to level up again, he's going down the, he's going to the ground. That way he can be with his girlfriend. Wow, this stream, this game is making me morbid. I talk to you. Hello again. Good evening, Doc. Are you sick? Uh, let me cure your bronchitis real Do quick. Do you need medical attention, sir? Fight, sir. Throughout history, some diseases have done more damage to armies than any weapon created by man. You are wise to be careful. You're working at the Pembroke Hospital, aren't you? That's That'll good help get the district status a bit there. higher, too. Goodbye, Mr. Blight. Take care of yourself. We were supposed to be dead. I can't hear I can't don't have anything for neurologia. So he's he's just boned. Alright, we're going to the mansion to see the red-headed vampire lady, I believe, in the Secret Society of Vampires. I believe it's yeah, it's right over here. <coughs> it's our blood daddy. Let's get a good look at him. He is literally our blood daddy. The famished queen? I am not your champion. But of course you are, son. As surely as you are the blood of my blood. I had to kill Mary. I have known your pain, child. Do not succumb to me. Silence! I dismiss you now! The land calls for a champion. All and everyone needs you. Silence. You know, that was your chance to learn something. I'm tired of all these puppet shows. Nope, can't ask the dude, you know, who knows everything about what he knows. Not that he would have answered. Satanic Jacob Marley. That's a heck of a combo. That's a new enemy type. Oh no, no, it's just someone on the ground. Blinker. Oh, these are guys are level 24. I can take them.
Check out my new ultimate. See if it kills him in one hit. Nice. I was hoping it would like affect, make it the animation look different if you actually use leveled it up. Plan the man. Just subscribe with Twitch Prime. You guys have been subscribing like crazy over the past two weeks, and so thank each and every one of you. But Flynn the Man, make sure you use those emotes you just bought, dude. And be sure to tell us about yourself in chat. Thank you guys so much for your support. I believe we're at like 60 or more over 60 subscribers. If we get to 80 subs, we actually unlock a new emote slot for the channel. I'm not sure if that's possible right now, but hey, something to look forward to. Okay, that there was literally no reason for that house to exist. It could have been an alley. I don't really know what I would use for my next emote slot, though. I'll have to come up with something once I get close to it. Oh, they're spraying more garlic or bug repellent. Wait, whoa, that's a fancy... Oh, that's an Ekon vampire. I haven't seen one of those. He's way over their level, though. I'll let them soften him up. Well, he really reamed them out. Fuck this. What would a fuck this boss emote look like, though? Hit the remember, emotes are small. You can't really put a lot of detail into them. Okay, into this courtyard. There are enemies with flamethrowers, but some of them have, like, garlic sprayers. So this is where she lives. What a splendid house. I really kind of want more than just three letters for a uh, emote. I, th I think I think it's a lot more fun if you have something actually visually interesting. How did you get a mosquito bite next to your balls? It's a question I don't think I've ever heard anyone ask before. Pinky mosquitoes. Reed, welcome. How are you? As good as one can be, considering the circumstances. Yes. Death and affliction seem prevailing themes of late. Please, come in. Did we you, do, did you develop discuss. a lisp in between cutscenes? Sounds like she has like she lost a I tooth before I she went into the recording you. booth. Not at all. Actually, I was counting on you visiting me tonight. How strange this painting. Beautiful, melancholic. Maybe she bit her tongue in the recording booth. Dignity. Indeed. A long time ago, a friend asked me to paint this for Raven, him. how are you? But I kept it in the end. I did not know you were a painter, my lady. There are many things you do not know about me, young Ekon. Call me Jonathan. <laughs> Please, call me Jonathan. Please excuse my behavior, Jonathan. I tend to tease my friends when uneasy. What is bothering you, my lady? Your letter was quite alarming. We will talk about this in a few minutes. For now, I would like you to tell me about yourself. How have you been since we last met, my friend? Mary was the murderous vampire. My sister Mary. She was made a vampire in the same way I was. She was the one killing all those... The game didn't really explain it very well. Vengeance is a powerful force for those betrayed. Made vampire through careless error. Victims by surprise. Killed her twice. In the end, she implored me to put an end to her misery. 
But still, I felt I had taken her life. Oh, good luck in the hole, Mystic. I am so sorry for my accidental cruelty. Had I known your dear Mary was still alive, I would never have sent you to pray for her soul in that church. There is no need to apologize, my lady. Your words have no. Been you should not buy this game. In these difficult Buy Bloodline: The Masquerade you, my friend. on Gog. If only we could have guided your poor sister through her terrible Far better version of this game. None of the characters' faces emote in this game. I swear. That's nothing new I for any of these people. That. If only I had known then how vampires are created. That is the scientist speaking. You're not really late, Eviola. We're really just getting started. Most of us do not know how it really works. Personally, I make sure my prey will not return to haunt me. What do you mean? I am merciless, Jonathan. I only feed on the dying, and I make sure they are dead before leaving their remains. Smart girl. Sure, you don't want to, you know, kill a ki kill a kid's mother or father in front of them and let the kid run away so they can come back in twenty years to seek revenge. Could make for a good video game plot. I came to the conclusion that my maker, whoever he might be, must be a powerful vampire. Certainly extremely old. How have you reached this conclusion? He seemed... I felt his power. I felt this power radiating like an aura every time he appeared. Most ancestral vampires of England were killed by the guard of Prewen half a century ago. I wonder who your maker could be. You have no idea who he could be? Some of the ancient ones fled England. Some may still be in hiding. All I know is you, my friend, are a pawn in some secret and obscure Lack of emotes of is disturbing. Uh, yes, yeah, Twitch always needs a lot of emotes to make it really feel personal, doesn't it? He is the only immortal I've oh, He seen seems stiff. All these characters are stiff. Ethereal form. Take this for the his time voice, being until you subscribe. Well, thank you. Thank you for the 25 ancient. bits. It was disturbing. I am afraid you are right. The simple fact that your blood made Mary such a strong Ekon proves that you must be of ancient lineage. I think I should ask the questions, your ladyship. After all, it was you who invited me to settle this most urgent of matters. Fair enough, Jonathan. The situation One is thing I've noticed about this game is like all the religious people the are Catholic. But this is London. Shouldn't they be like me. Protestants? I would be delighted to I mean, discuss. It's a country that has its very own church idols, named after it. If we survive the dark nights to come, we shall have all the time in the world to speak, you and I. For now, please follow me, Jonathan. I must say, your house is exquisite. One yeah, I imagine the there's still a lot of Catholics in England, but I would just imagine, you know, for story-wise setting, you'd want to go with Protestant religion. I took the liberty of having tea served. You can still drink tea. Can't keep it down, but I do so enjoy the aroma. Let us toast to make believe. And of course, to your health, Jonathan. And to yours, my lady. This is so romantic. You just smelled it. Like, well, I guess that's all she can do is smell it. What are bits Please for? There are donations. Call me Elizabeth. Each one is worth basically so, a penny. Lady, why truly did you invite me here? I've been asked to deliver an official invitation to meet the Ascalon Club. Who might they be? Who are they? Really? They are the embodiment of vampire law in Britain. You know, it's hard to think of a, of a game that has lazier camera work than this game in the last 10 years of video games. How many are they? Only a small number of powerful and deceitful immortals. All of them entangled in a sticky web of shadow cabinets. This is the British way of having sex. Trade. Why, why am I willing to believe that? Will they fight the guard of Prewen? I doubt it. Fergal was Lord Redgrave's executioner forever and a day. By defeating that beast, you deprived them of a powerful weapon. Why use you to contact me? Because they know we are close. 
I mean, an actual cutscene would have the camera actually doing something dynamic besides just showing these guys, these two, from this angle. How to use it. It's really an awkward angle when you when you're trying to like see characters' faces and well, not that they emote, but I think it's one of the reasons this game feels so lifeless. Actually, do you think Bethesda will possibly announce another Elder Scrolls? Uh, probably not. I think you need another year before that happens. Have they threatened you in any way? Not at all. Maybe then an Elder Scrolls spin-off or something like they're doing with Fallout. It is only logical, considering the critical After all, Fallout Elder Scrolls needs a new mobile game, I suppose, since Fallout Shelter did so well. Why wouldn't they want to do that? Why not ask for your help? Since you are obviously a powerful and influential immortal yourself. You have to understand that I am invisible to the eyes of Ascalon. Uh, Mystic is continuing his adventures in the creative writing tab well, on the Discord. As long as they leave me alone. Godspeed, good sir. Should I trust them? Of course not. Do not misunderstand me. They can be very useful. But I believe their long-term goals differ from yours. Why meet them? Why meet them then? Because nothing truly important can be achieved in this city without their consent. They could be powerful allies in this current situation. I said it last night, but this game desperately needs to be been a book instead of a video game. Should I lie to them? We all lie, Jonathan. It falls to you to choose your behavior. The most important rule is to show them due respect. They have done nothing but impede my investigation since I became known to them. Oh, I thought that the camera was going to do something. He just went back to over the shoulder. I guess they Never mind. see you as Ascalon material. They must have found out what happened to your sister. Yep, Andromeda, the that's exactly the, the point of the game. Missing the mark. I'm not sure I can accept their invitation. I have seen their handiwork. How Fergal the Beast imposed the club's law. You have no choice, Jonathan. Even I would not openly defy Lord Redgrave, the chairman of the Ascalon Club. I wonder if anyone makes fun of him for being a vampire and having the word Grave as his last name. What can you tell me about Lord Redgrave? Who is he? Lord Redgrave is the founder and chairman of the Ascalon Club. Most mortals know him as the Earl of Bristol. He is rich and extremely influential. Is his, you know, second in command called Carl Bloodstone, maybe? Jonathan Speartip? Nathaniel Redfang? Have you met him? Only on rare occasions, for he never goes outside the club. Well, I was actually really uh, looking forward to this game, Neptune. It just kind of like, after playing it for a while, then it's like, yeah, I know what it's all about now. That's why I don't usually let myself get excited for games too often. How long has he been a vampire? Lord Redgrave claims to be the progeny of... Since I was kind of hoping this game would be more like Bloodline the, the Masquerades. Who or Masquerade lived. the Bloodline. If that is true... Instead, we got something that's more akin to Life is Strange, only with vampires and a bare-bones fighting system. How powerful is his reach? The Ascalon Club may be the most influential secret. All right, here's my prediction. Redgrave is going to be the guy who talks to us as a blood is a blood illusion. They are all very powerful. We're going to be, oh, it's you. They are not all immortals. How is that? The club is mainly comprised of political figures who seek the safety and expansion of the empire. I love a working version of the Bloodlines that was actually allowed to be finished. Immortality. Any familiar or famous names? As the richest, most Supposedly that game might eventually tycoon, get a sequel. Aloysius or Dawson made by a different studio, though. That's worrisome. Ascalon material and has been watched for years. If you are convinced I must meet him, I will heed your advice. What games will I put up for a vote next? Probably Bayonetta 2 and something else. I'm not sure what, though. shoulders with London's vampire elite. But we have no choice. I kind of want something that's short and I know I'll enjoy critical. after yes. this game. The God of Prewen has called for a second great hunt of our kind. And they will stop at nothing to eliminate us. Will the God of Prewen and the Ascalon Club fight each other? I doubt it. 
If Prewen really launched a great hunt, I think most of the Ekons I know would flee the country to escape the bloodbath. Mm, should we fight back? Should we fight back? I will not be hunted down like an animal again. I admire your courage, Jonathan. Uh, but the best way no, I don't think I'll be sending any more Outlast games. The only other, the only the other epidemic. one is one, and it's DLC, is which way to clear the air. would be a lot harder to send because you know no talking main character. I think I saw them kill an echo. Not impossible, obviously, house. since I sent Far Cry Four they or Five. Have a list with names. But I still prefer having a, a voice main character. They must have collected intelligence on vampire identities and whereabouts. They are a resourceful lot. You know, maybe having an oboe play over a long conversation, or whatever instrument this is, what is wasn't the best of ideas, because I am just, like, slowly drifting away. 75 years ago. In just a few nights, the guard of Prewen located and destroyed most of the old British vampires. How did you, How did survive? you survive the first hunt? I fled. Jonathan. This is actually reminding me like of the, the Star Wars prequels where char characters would just sit down and talk and, and that would be 90% of the scenes when there wasn't a lightsaber battle going on. My trail. Walking and talking. Walking and talking. Why is there so much talking? What's wrong with... God, I love Red Letter Meters. Those reviews are so good. Why start a second one? Pre-when has always Those of you who haven't watched Plinky reviews, make sure you get on that. Mankind. My guess is they suspect one or more of us is the cause of the epidemic. You should flee then. Leave oh, it's London his turn for the, the camera to focus on his face, I see. I have seen the guard in action. They are merciless. Your concern warms my heart, Jonathan. But fear this, not. This camera is so static, I'm pretty sure I'm going to get burned in on my monitor of this, uh, this lady's face. Scottish manor. I could hide you in my luggage, if you wish. Thank you for the offer. I shall keep it in mind, but I have much to do here. There is a question I must ask you. Could Lord Redgrave be my maker? I doubt it. If Lord Redgrave had made you his progeny, he would not have seemed so surprised when you demonstrated the strength of your lineage. Uh, what is the plan? Tell me, vampire mistress. What is the plan? The plan is we both try to save this city, you and I. Go to Ascalon, accept their proposition, and use their influence to promote your agenda. And what shall you do? What will you do? I still have contacts and old friends in this town. I, shall make some I wish they would have had fun with this and, and just have these characters voice these lines situation. like they're in a bad high school play. We need Lord charity. Ascalon will help you save London from the vampire menace. Oh, vampire husband, please help London. I can at least get into I that. Save London? The epidemic is the priority. You must find its origin. Does this game not have cutscenes, or it. how did you miss the last this thirty the minutes of this conversation? Way to solve the crisis. Will I ever discover the identity of my? Uh, I'll eventually Maybe do Grand Theft Auto V. It's just that that'll be a sure big project, so I got to make sure I have enough vampire. time to do it and not but take like a month. Fled England long ago. You have no idea at all. You seem to know so many things about the secrets of the vampire underworld. Even if I had my suspicions, I would not dare give you a name so soon. Oh God! All could I you imagine if this, the if this con if this conversation ended with the uh, keep you informed the freaking owl from uh, Ocarina of Time? It's like, would you like to repeat everything I just said? And you accidentally click it. I would. That'd be the end of the stream, end of the game. Like, well, I have to do another game. I guess you guys would be getting Dead Space Two at that point. Please forgive my bluntness, but I have to ask. Was it you? Did you make me? Oh, Jonathan, I know you shall always have a gnawing doubt about who made you an immortal, but I swear I had nothing to do with it. 
One day soon. Oh, the camera's moving. Yellow text means the camera moves. Mystery. And I shall help you in your research, I promise. For now, you must go to the Ascalon Club and play their game. Will I see you again at the Pembroke Hospital? No. You will find me here if you need me. I shall conduct inquiries alone, and we can then share our discoveries. Will you not visit Pembroke again? No. I must remain discreet and avoid attracting attention to Pembroke Hospital. Even the main character has to repeat but his questions now. Sustain yourself. I shall not, Jonathan. Fear not. I'm used to it. When will we meet again? As soon as you meet Lord Redgrave, I suppose. Fear not, my dear. I shall only be a heart's beat away. I want to thank you for all your support. Oh my god. And your help. How long did this conversation did go on for? Did anyone keep check at the time? And call that had to be at least 20 minutes. I should be honored, my lady. Then it is settled. Finally, some good news in these dark hours. Thank you. I appreciate the advice. 20 minutes. I had best prepare myself to meet this Lord Redgrave now. How thrilling to meet the Earl of Bristol in the flesh, so to speak. Something tells me you're not very keen on the man. Don't get me wrong. The gentlemen of the Ascalon Club are honorable, but their attitude and opinions are somewhat antiquated. <laughs> I see. As long as they deny access to female applicants, I will leave them to their antediluvian considerations as to the natural order of things. Jonathan, promise me you'll be careful. Even vampires are sexist. Of course. But why the fear in your voice? Look at me, Jonathan. I am. I mean, really look at me, young Ekon. Well, we got second base. We may be deceptive by nature. But this heart of mine has always told the truth. Oh. Elizabeth. Oh wait, was that a romance scene? Go, my friend. Um, well, I sin Fortnite. No, I don't think you should expect that one. No, I am hot under the collar under that after that scene, man. I, I can tell why he really wanted it there. Okay, I'm gonna stop complaining so much about this game. That's not fun to watch. You guys deserve better than me just like bitching at the game. Time to make this shit fun. Alright. No more complaints. That's not how this stream goes. So... Time to visit the Ascalon Club. That's right, pal. This is where the game gets good, alright? The Ascalon Club. In the West End. Alright, game. It's been a rough going up until now, but now you gotta pull out all the stops and impress me. We're going to meet a secret society of ancient vampires who are possibly dangerous. Looks like there's one over there killing a lot of people. I'll let them continue. It's locked. So we have to go around. Wait, that's the only way. Oh, no, no. I'm confused. Okay, I guess I gotta go around the river to get around to it. Let's let them weaken each other up first then. Alright, I guess we go around here and go across that bridge. How dare you interfere with my foot! I'll thank you for the bits. I would ask you to send The Witcher 3, but yeah, that'd be another long one. I get, there's some games that are so long, I have to time when I do them properly, or I'll be at it all month long. Well, 
will I send DLC in a game? Normally I don't. Usually DLC, there's not enough in it to send in the, in the first place, so I usually just, nah. So we don't want to go up to Whitechapel. We want to go this way. It will take more than 200 hours to finish the walking... TW3. There's a lot of games that actually can start with the TW. Which one are you talking about? It can't be The Walking Dead, obviously. Oh, The Witcher 3. Oh, okay. yeah, that's right. We were just talking about that. It is it, Only if you try to do everything in the game does it take that long. If you stick mainly to the main quest, you can beat it in about probably about 40 hours or so. I cannot enter. that terrifying sounds. Game isn't letting me do anything but saunter, so a cutscene's about to happen. Whenever a game makes your main character start sauntering, you know something's about to happen. That was the vampire I saw earlier. This war takes no prisoners. Hey, what? Wait, that was what it wanted me to see? Them killing something I've already seen happen? What? Okay, sure. Ooh, those are level 28s. Let us not go down there. Alright, we need to go up and to the left. Unlock this too. Now let me get back to the West End quickly. Or how would I even send Roblox, guys? That's not a game that you you just the had a story End. mode. Never have I felt so. I'd be like trying to send to regular Minecraft. Right, there's a hideout up here we can use as well. Oh, wow, I am really underleveled for this place. I've sinned story mode. That's all the Minecraft I'm going to send. street we're definitely gonna have to eat some more people soon didn't I have like got a new list of people from this place yeah there's like an entire new list of people this is the final group of people though and then we're done with all that garbage Let's meet all the new... Like, we just fought a, a monster right up the street, and there's just down the street. It's just the a disconnect uh, every single time it happens. The heart of British vampire society. Not quite as subtle as I expected. Have you ever considered playing on easy mode? Uh, not really. I like to... Only time I've ever played on easy mode is when I do Final Fantasy 13 games. Good evening, miss. Oh my god, no. Please, Mr. Vampire, don't kill me. Please, no. I'm too young to die. I still have so much to offer this At least world. someone finally realized Wait, it. No. Why do you think I would... What? Don't worry, Dr. Reed. I know you wouldn't harm me. Mother told me you were in this part of town and might drop by. Your mother? My name is Charlotte, sir. Charlotte Ashbury. My mother taught me long ago how to recognize the signs that betray a vampire. I understand she also taught you how to tease and gently mock innocent young Ekons. It's a pleasure to meet you, Miss Charlotte. Okay, so, uh, sure. He's healthy. 
What do you think about this part of town? I was raised here, and I suppose it feels like home. Did we meet her mother somewhere? You grew up in this part of town too, did you not? Having trouble recalling all these characters. Yes, I was born a few streets away. A small world, is it not? Did you ever imagine that my mother was your neighbor all that time? That you could have met her in the dark alley at night? You won't trick me twice, young lady. Wait, her mother is the we vampire both lady? Lady Ashbury never hunts or attacks prey. How does that work? Come on, Doctor. Don't tell me you never thought about that possibility. Her fangs on your neck. Oh, are you blushing, Dr. Reed? Is there something that's bothering you? Too much selfishness and individualism uh, for my taste. You mean if I use something out of Even five, something no out of epidemic. ten rating scale? Even Neither. That's partly true. I don't like either of those. May I remind you that many charitable institutions are financed by the selfish and filthy rich. I suppose you're right. But society must reform and renew itself or we are all done for. So vampires can have human children? Is that what I'm getting from this? Oh, she's adoption. She's adopted. adopted. Okay, never mind. What do you want to know? That explains it. I was getting very confused. Who are your real parents? Elizabeth Ashbury is my real mother. She raised me and has taken care of me all my life. I have no idea who my progenitors are or were. Do you live with her? I still spend a lot of time in my mother's mansion, but I have my own house now. I'm I guessing she would not be very happy see. if we ate her daughter. One day, I'll have my death to face. How did you meet Lady Ashbury? First, I was an orphan in the institution for girls she manages in the West End. When I was ten, she adopted me. And I have lived Will I with her send ever an actual PS4 you know and Xbox? No. I'm going to have to say no on that. The word is Econ, Doctor. And no, I had no idea why my mother only showed up at night. She told me everything when I turned 16. Though I suspected the truth for a long time before that. What are you doing out here? You mean, what do I do outside at night since I am a woman? Let me ask you a question, sir. Would you ask the same question of a man? Actually, yes. You know, I really didn't want I to mention this, but this game has been really starting to, to beat me over the head right. with all the, Considering the risks. whole well, sexist issue, know, I for and the it's right starting to get in the way. Women. I can't Why just I wait deny it anymore. When men can vote at 21. It's been happening again and again recently. I don't mind if you have that message and you want to get it across, but whew, once is enough. Are you a suffragette, then? Oh, you really are, Elizabeth's girl. Without a doubt. All adult women have the right to vote in the US, in New Zealand, and in Australia. But women here can't vote unless they are property owners. No need to convince me, Miss Charlotte. I have shared your opinion for a long time, even before I met Emmeline Pankhurst. Really? Oh. If we, eat her, if we eat her, her mother will so be much. very upset, so no, Too we can't. Bad, there aren't more men like Plus, she's like a level city. five. I'm only level three. I couldn't eat her if I wanted to. How are the locals reacting to your claims? People here can't wait for a wall to be built to isolate the West End from the rest of town. That's how progressive they are. Oh this my house, god. This lady up. needs purple Explosives hair and a, a degree in gender studies and, and, a, and you know diversity she was my training. Best friend and a suffragette too. She was supposed to campaign with me tonight, but hasn't turned up. Have you any reason to be worried about her? Recently, Emily started to believe in well, she got interested in vampires. I'm afraid she might be in trouble. Let me guess. You spoke to her about us, didn't you? Despite your mother's warning. I think I should try to find your friend. Oh, White purple hair? Yeah, it's just that. I don't know I why it is, but multicolored hair has become a thing in that group. Thanks, Dr. Reed. And please don't Or maybe that's just a stereotype I'm buying into, and it, and it isn't this, actually that case. What exactly has your mother told you about me? Your name and profession, obviously, and the mystery about your maker. I'm sorry to hear about what happened to your sister, sir. Mother says it was. But just say if she had a Twitter account in the 18, 19, in 1918, what your mother? Is. We could probably Why predict what she'd it? be tweeting about. My mother is the most compassionate woman. 
Well, I have nothing against purple hair. It just depends on what if it's being used to facilitate political action for some reason. What, wait, what did she just say? Uh, no. Of course not. You have nothing to fear from me or your mother. Good to know. And don't worry, my mother told me everything like I need to know about vampire tricks. Their nature as well as creatures. I never thought of that before. Your mother is not like any other vampire I've met. I believe she thinks the same about you, Dr. Reed. Why did she you know adopt why you? Lady Asprey chose you to become her daughter. No, I don't. Each time I ask her that question, she smiles and says it's precisely because I dare to ask such questions. Do you ever regret that she chose you? Of course not. Though I often wonder if she adopted others before me. If so, where are they buried? How was it for them to pass through life with a never aging mother? Sounds confusing. All right, we've Goodbye, talked her to Charlotte. death. Time to go. Give my best regards to your mother when you see her. She's been quite busy these last few nights. I suspect you may see her before me. All right, who's next? It's going to yak our ears off. Remember, don't let any strangers... Good evening, sir. Please forgive me for disturbing This dude better have the most English I'm accent ever. I judge a man by his title, but by his attitude. And All right, you are not disturbing that, that's what I was expecting. I am Calhoun Russell, and I welcome you. Well, I must admit, it's good to receive a warm welcome for once. I'm Dr. I'm Jonathan Reed. Welcome, Dr. Reed. Welcome to my humble shop. Do you have any family nearby? Yep, sorry guys, What's but you have to get to know these characters so you can find story like missions and also know which ones you want to eat. Way. London's Lone Gourmet. What a strange title. I used that name in my early years when I was a food critic, and I kept it. Really? I'm afraid. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He doesn't, he's just a traitor, so we're not going to eat him ever anyway, so. How is. Uh, false. I'm afraid the newspapers are. Si well, that worked, anyways. It doesn't matter. What can you. Finding a uh, he gave us a quest. Sweet. I'm Is it not a little on the But what about oh. All right, what do you sell? I may have a look at your goods, Mr. Russell. A food critic who sells nothing but drugs. Got it. your oldest friend Clarence Clarence Crossley. Oh. Slayer thank you for your four month subscription My dude God so you survived you just had your too. had your birthday party so sorry I didn't recognize you well congrats first. how old are you I man almost didn't recognize you either war does that to men I heard In my case it was true you're 16 congrats I on the horror that lies underneath well depending on where you're from I guess you could be of age Congratulations. When did you escape the war and return to London? You know what's funny? I almost never think about the war. Not anymore. I'm involved in another kind of battle now. You did paintball. Now that's an excellent way of celebrating your birthday. I know what you mean. I haven't done paintball or laser tag in a long time. This time actually, think about the it's been war years since my return. Of course, the epidemic. I bet you've been busy as well. Forgive me, John. I used to love it I too. I want to sound selfish. Specifically, we did laser tag where I'm where I'm at. Even though you know paintball is possible, I just didn't own a gun. What is laser tag is a lot cheaper to get into. I saw terrible things during the war. Horrors I thought I'd forget. They're here too. They're everywhere. 
Vampires. Why do I record without subtitles on? Because if you've noticed, my videos have my own subtitles of my voice of what I'm saying. And if I have an, the game's own subtitles on underneath that, they'll clash with each other and make it almost impossible to read sometimes. How is your wife, Venus? We've spent so much time away from each That's other. That's the reason. And so many things have happened. But you're alive. You returned in one piece and you have a family. How many soldiers can say the same? Believe me, it's not quite that simple. Unlike you, I'm not the man I used to be. Is everything all right at home? Surely Venus was relieved to see you return from France in one piece. You love the Detroit you video? Thank you. Like in this part of town, Johnny. Venus fears for our family the, the Detroit video has been doing very well. I'm actually surprised. Jimmy. Usually a 30 minute video, people wouldn't have time to watch it. He's not worth very you much. need some rest, Clarence. You should try to sleep. Okay. You should try to sleep, Clarence. Try playing vampire. I have a rating. How did I acquire one of those? I just broke into this dude's mansion and just stealing everything. Good evening, Avery. Mr. Jonathan, I can't believe my own eyes. Oh, it's a miracle. We all thought you were. Oh, this is my family home. Oh. Sir, your poor sister. What a tragedy. I know, Avery. I know about my sister's murder. Miss Reed expected you to return to assist with the funeral. Right up until the last minute. Where have you been, Mr. Jonathan? We needed you here. I am refused to answer that question. I'm sorry I could not be here for Mary's funeral. Do I see demographic strong, changes sir. across my videos? No, it's pretty concurrent. It's about 70-80% male and the rest is female. The priest and, I, and the age group stays the no same as well. Else attended your sister's funeral. To be present at the funeral with you both was my dearest wish, Avery. But I'm sorry, I simply could not attend. I would not dare to question your absence, Mr. Jonathan. All I can say is that we missed you a great deal during these difficult days. How is mother? What is the situation in this part of town? For a time, the who's the old man? He's like the family but the butler for my family in but this the game. The situation is getting much worse. Have you no relatives anywhere? I'll understand if you want to take a few days to see family. Your father managed to guarantee my earnings as long as I take care of this house, sir. My sisters are dead, and I've never met my nephews. I'll stay, sir. How is my mother? Yeah, we're not, not gonna well, we're gonna drink, not gonna eat our butler or our mother. Very fragile. Well, like send Doki Doki literature back home. The police. I don't think so. What happened? Miss Reed was found walking in the streets. She kept saying she had spoken with. Count Chocula make a cameo. We can only hope so. She's resting now. I would take it at this point. Has she received appropriate medical care? I'm taking care of Miss Reed myself. Hospitals are so overwhelmed by the epidemic that they can only accept patients infected by influenza. You know, I am always impressed when people know how to put umlauts and all those little dashes and dots over their letters in chat, or anywhere, really. So smoke weed every day, boy. My hat's off to you for that impressive ability. Perhaps we could arrange if a If you haven't noticed, trip. I'm easily impressed. Somewhere sunny, like France. She has always been very fond of France. I think leaving London could do her good. I'm afraid Miss Reed is too frail for the moment. Recently, she started going out at night without remembering it. I have to watch her carefully. Six, uh, yeah, I'm impressed as well, dude. You even made a little face with it. You can eat an entire pizza by yourself. Well, I did that earlier today, actually. Tell me the truth, Avery. Do you feel forced to stay here? 
Would you leave this house without the arrangement made by my father? No, sir. I have nowhere else to go. And I promised your father I'd take care of his family as long as I live. This house is dead, Avery. There is a curse on this family. You really should consider leaving. If only you could have been here sooner or more often. Maybe this house would not be that empty. But you're here now, sir. So my task is not over. You serve the family excellently. You have served this family extremely well. No, Avery. let's not let's not call this guy your Alfred. Let's not get that far ahead of ourselves. Terrible times is much. No, I'm not going to suck the, the blood or dry. He's a good guy. He's All part of the family. I ask is that you take care of my own funeral if I die before the end of the epidemic. No mass grave, please, sir. Do you really think I don't take enough care of my mother, Avery? Yes, I do, Mr. Jonathan. You clearly have something more to say. Speak your mind, Avery. I know you work hard to help the sick, but what will you do once the epidemic is over? My home My here. My home is here, and I have nowhere else to go. But this house will need some improvements if I move here. Some radical changes. That's good news. Whatever changes you have in mind, I'm sure we will find an arrangement that suits your mother also. Are butlers still a thing? Is there like actual, uh, f like traditional butlers? Do those still happen anywhere? Do you still see a pop of entertainment, but I've never actually encountered like, oh, this is the butler. And he's like got the proper posh English accent. He's been to like butler school. Goodbye, Avery. Please like watch here, over my usually it seems like everyone just has an attendant these days or something. Jonathan, but please return as soon as possible. Butlers are still a thing. Hmm. How much of a house we can only go through this one area? Well, the rich usually have like you know attendants and stuff. They don't have. Or at least in America. I guess in America you don't really find butlers that often. I'd imagine, yeah, a butler would probably make really good money. They're basically a live-in worker, essentially. 24-7. Yes. Are they specifically always English, or can anyone become a butler? Still need more parts for the stakes, final level. Incendiary damage. I need sodium hydroxide for that, though. Consequently, I can just do more damage. Actually, equip that pistol. I haven't done that in a while. That doesn't work.
Mother. Mother, I've returned home. Mother. <coughs> Good evening. Jonathan. Is it you? Where have you been, my prodigal son? I'm right here, Mother. I'm finally home. Yes. But this son of mine was dead and is alive again. He was lost and now found. But where is your sister? Where is Mary? Uh, Mary. You've forgotten, haven't you, Mother? She... She is gone, Mother. I know she's gone. The question is, when will she return as you have? I miss my grandson so much. It's been days since their last visit. Hmm, Mommy, you don't sound right. Have you returned to Whitechapel Cemetery since Mary's funeral? I never want to go back to that awful place. Wait. I think I went back once. And you were there too. And Mary? No. That can't be true. It was just a bad dream, Mother. A nightmare, yes. Mary no, she's was not a vampire. so angry. I walked back home alone. Mary was going to make her into one, but if we stopped her. If that kind policeman had not called Avery from the station, I don't know what would have happened. Mother, do you know what's been going on in this area? Not really. I don't go out much due to the epidemic, and when I do, I tend to get lost. What do you mean you get lost? I hope you don't go outside alone. Of course not. When I go out, I'm not going to kill my own mother in the game. Me, but he leaves me there sometimes, and I have trouble finding the way back. She's a level one mesmerized, so she's very easy to. She's worth nothing, though. Tell me, mother, how are you? All alone in this big house with only Avery to take care of you. See you later, I'm Mystic. Sad most of the time. Sad that you have left me here alone. Sad that you don't tell me when you come or go. I'm so sorry, Mother. It wasn't supposed to be like this. I was coming home. I was home. London, the Thames. And then it happened. What happened, Johnny? I was attacked. I was attacked, Mother. And I've not been the same. Well, I sin, Devil May Cry. You mean the, you the rumored fifth game in the series? Sure. I was Why not? Worried, you know. You were the last member of the family of whom I had no news. Even Mary comes more often than you. Do you think Avery is right? Do you think I should take better care of you? I don't blame you, but you abandoned me, son. A mother should not survive her children. The original Devil May Cry. It's That'd be a tough to one. There's actually not a lot of plot there. It'd be a really short video. I know I have failed you since I returned. I even watched you bury Mary from a distance. From now on, I will protect you. You have my word. You don't have to apologize to me, Johnny. Do you think you can't I Ubisoft you your own mother, guys? Someone has to do that for you have and then I become your villain. That much, mother. Am I still your son? You are still, and you'll always be. Despite your pale skin. Your bloody eyes and that echoing sadness in your voice. I was like, you're a vampire, my boy. Do you need anything, Mother? Can I help you? I just want you to stay with me, Jonathan. Your room is ready. I asked Avery to make your bed. I'll stay as long as I can, I promise. Do you need anything else? Just one thing. Stop staring at me like that. As much as I love you, it breaks my heart to look at those empty and dead eyes. Are you working on a new painting? Not recently. I have trouble focusing on my subject and my mind quickly drifts. It's the same thing when I try to write poetry. I recently met a talented painter with an excellent technique. I wish you two could meet. I'm sure you'd like her. I'd be glad to meet her. What is her name? Is she famous? Is she dead too? She's not famous, and her name is of no importance. And yes, she is also dead. The important thing is, I hope you two get along. If she ever fancies meeting your mother, yeah, that was a weird line. Is she I'd dead be glad too? To welcome her into my home. Didn't get that. All right. God, she's got more lines. Why do you say Mary is visiting you? 
You know that's impossible. Why should it be? Are you not standing in front of me right now? Why should it be any different with your sister? But Mary really is dead, Mother. Yes. And are you not dead too? Isn't your father dead? And my grandson and my son-in-law, you're all gone. But you all still visit me from time to time. But Let's I'm lie to her. dead, Mother. I'm really here, talking to you, trying not to cry. Oh, it breaks my heart to have to tell you this. But of course you're dead, my darling boy. Just look at you, as pale as my Mary. Well, at least she knows. Or at least somewhat. Goodbye, Mother. We've heard enough from her, though. Try to rest now. <clears throat> Goodbye, son. Please come back soon. Let's get out of this depressing place. Uh, I don't care. Sunday walks in the park. We got a special, uh, yeah, man, um, a side quest from that. Where's the door to leave? Do I plan to do the rest of the God of War games this year? No. I might do them eventually. I'm not I'm not going to promise when I'll do them though. I understand exactly okay, what's left to check on here? Okay, we're out of the... This takes me somewhere I don't need to go yet. Let's check out... Continue this place. The music changes means that... The, you're like in a different area, that's all it is. Is that gonna be another sewer level? Oh shit, I didn't actually mean to go down there. Unnecessary loading. Yeah, there's gonna be a third sewer level in this game at some point. She doesn't know we're a vampire, she just, because she's half crazed, she also believes we're dead and just walking around. She does have reason to think that. Her other, her other daughter who died came back after all. Okay, that's the place I need to go, so let's check around real quick. Bad day? Good evening, miss. Can I help you? I'm a doctor. Dr. Jonathan Reed. I am... I am... Karina Billow. I don't need any doctor. The rats. Where are the rats? Miss, you don't seem well at all. Are you afraid of rats? Has one bitten you? No. It's me who bites them. Tasty, juicy, disgusting rats. I can't stop eating them. Help me, please. Help me to disobey the voice. Excuse me? Huh. A lady who eats rats. Probably be in our best interest to get rid of her. Personal questions about your rat. Well, that's all hidden by hints. What happened to you? What happened to you? The rats. The answer hides in their little crunchy bones. Their juicy, tiny brains. Miss Billow, please try to concentrate. I feel they were running out of ideas Why how to make a creepy character in this game. So much. 
the voice in my head. He forces me to do so. Drink their blood, he said. Eat their flesh. Tell me about the voice in your Tell head. Tell me about the voice in your head. Who is it? Can you describe it? Is it someone you know? Someone you met? Keep your mouth shut, he said. Don't ever speak about me or I'll abandon you. Help me, please, Doctor. Do you feel compelled to obey that voice, Miss Billow? Even if you're loath to submit to it? Yes. Please. Help. Tell me about, about you yourself, and... Miss Billow. Why well, do a, 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 a food critic just down the street? I'm hungry. Need to eat? Have you got something for me? Blood, perhaps? You know, these two actually Can could have a decent conversation because he eats a lot of rats himself. What you did for work? I was strong, proud. I campaigned for good causes. But that was before. Before. It does not matter anymore. I'm so hungry. What is the local news hereabouts, Miss Billow? Shadows. Shadows hunting shadows. Whispers in the is dark. Is there any culture that actually Pestilence. just like really considers Suffering. rats to be a delicacy? Death. I know there's some that eat it, but it's usually still not exactly something that's usually seen as savory. And with we've done everything we I can with her. Go now. Goodbye, Miss Billow. It's usually something everyone eats when they're like starving and have nothing else. Island, they eat rats. Is it something like actually common though? Is what I mean. Like, well, here's a nice street vendor stall, and they're serving, you know, grilled bread. Rats are dirty in all cultures. They are in mine, that's for sure. I get in. Okay, we need to go in there. Just unlock that, by the way. All right, let's go talk to the vampire lords or something. Is this the right place? No, but it is a new play. Let's do this first, then we'll go talk to the Vampire Lords. Hello? Is anyone there? Jonathan, is that you? I did not know you were back in London. Oh, she knows us. Oh, my dear Johnny. I'm so sorry for your loss. Mary was such a sweetheart. Thank you, Venus. This is how you talk Mary, to someone you're like dearly, to dear friends actually. with, by the way, by cowering behind the door. Well, I can't do anything with her. Mesmerize level 4 required. Forgive me. With the epidemic, I tend to forget people are supposed to sleep at night. I'll tell you what. Come back tomorrow for tea. I'll be glad to see you then. How many people have I talked to here? They're still... We, we've talked to them a good chunk of them. Let's go talk to Mr. Redgrave. Press me game. Second chance. Make this like the best character in the game. Do you know where you are standing right now? In front of the Ascalon Club, I presume. The Ascalon Club only summons or ostracizes. What is your business tonight? I received an invitation. I'm Dr. Jonathan Reed. 
You're starting the timer. Welcome to the Ascalon. Mm, good on you, Precious. Dr. Reed. Please proceed. Lord Redgrave is waiting on you upstairs. Does he normally keep such a welcoming place with blood and dead people? Oh, these are vampire hunters. There they they came under attack. Here. I'm Welcome sure the, the Ascalon, Ascalon Club has the money to replace. Oh, I send Ghost Recon Wildlands. Welcome I don't think so. You guys always ask for the hardest possible games to send. You know that? Dardigan, will you send uh, Planescape Torment? It's locked, all right. I'm sure Dead Space 2 will get done eventually. Can I send WoW and all of its expansions, plus the lore? Let's go back outside. I wish this game, if you're going to go outside, it's going to trigger a loading screen. They would at least do the common courtesy of saying, do you want to leave this location like any other game would do? Send Daggerfall. Why not Arena while I'm at it? Good dagger. Oh. Strong but small knife, mainly used to pierce and rip open the opponent. I think my steak is better. Send Dwarf Fortress. Send Darkest Dungeon, Dardigan. Send Darkest Dungeon. It's locked. Well, that's obviously where I need to go. Before we go through the curtains, let's check this room, though. E to Ascalon Club Basement. Would I ever do a retro throwback? Something I love? Maybe. I wouldn't mind sending Final Fantasy IX at some point. Like the the original Deus Ex. Good evening, gentlemen. Good evening. They all look the same. Good friends, if I may have your attention. Behold our visitor, the good Dr. Reed. Newborn of blood so pure and strong that even my friend Fergal Bancher was no match for him. Hear, hear, hear. Hear. Come forward, young Ekon, for we have so much to discuss. Welcome to the Ascalon Club, Dr. Reed. I am Lord Redgrave, Earl of Bristol and Chairman of this exclusive association. Lord Redgrave. At last we meet. I want to tell you about timeshares. to make your acquaintance. I have heard some astounding things about you. Please accept my condolences for your loss, Dr. Reed. Thank you, my lord. Lady Ashbury expressed your wish to meet me. Yes. The lady has always been a useful acquaintance, though not always reliable. Is she a good friend of yours? Uh, she is a close friend. She's a close friend. And I'm honored that she feels the same about me. Hmm. 
The centuries have taught me never to trust a woman completely, especially if she is immortal. Too prone to emotions, if you ask me. Too fickle when it comes to important decisions. My lord, do not expect me to speak ill of Lady Ashbury. Of course not, and I praise your loyalty. Would you offer the same fidelity to the Empire? What do you mean? I speak of this scowl. What a cis male vampire. Country. You have been on the front line in the East End, but the time has come to open up a second front here. The epidemic has escaped the quarantine. You have new cases of the outbreak. We don't know for certain, but we cannot allow Fight the, the vampire patriarchy, the guys. Heads of patriarchy. Great Britain. Uh, so why me? Why do you suddenly need me? The Ascalon you love the Detroit video the become human. Thank you, you Virtual. Fit the bill. Your scientific and medical reputation alone would qualify you as a candidate. You want me to find possible sources of the outbreak in the West End? Is that it? Ah, straight to the point, like all eager newborns. We shall have time to talk about all this, Dr. Reed. But first, I should like to get to know you better. Talk? Is that the only reason you asked me here? Well, no. I also wanted to meet the intriguing Ekon who made such a powerful progeny of his sister. You have not learned the name of your maker, am I correct? I do not. No, I haven't. Have no embarrassment, Dr. Reed. We all make mistakes. But whatever your lineage, you are definitely Ascalon material. What do you mean? I would like you to become a member of the Ascalon Club and to serve me as such. Uh, I have questions about that. Before I accept, I have so many questions. Please ask. What does membership imply? What does it mean? This is a great. I can't move the camera from his face. We're just gonna stare at him in profile. The interests of the crown. That you great direction. Servant of the British Empire. Have you any official recognition? Do you have any official recognition from the government? A charter from His Majesty the King? No. Of course, the Ascalon Club publicly supports the Empire, but the true nature of its members remains a secret. Hmm. Am I supposed to obey? Am I supposed to? Yeah, I'm not sitting Roblox. As Get that out of your head. Chairman of the club, I alone am entitled to make demands of I our just members. passed 100,000 views and here I on do Twitch. Appreciate That's a, I guess that is a milestone, isn't it? Thank you guys. Now to get 100,000 followers. What is the Ascalon Club's express purpose? We follow the credo of William Marshall, the greatest knight who ever lived. As was he, we are sworn to protect the British Empire. What does Ascalon mean? Is William Ascalon Marshall a real guy? Or is that made up of the, 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 the vampire lord? patron saint of England when he slew the dragon. And like that lance, we pierce the hearts of all our nation's enemies. We're basically vampire CIA. William Marshall founded the Ascalon Club. Not exactly. William Marshall granted me immortality, and I founded the club a few years later. The good knight has been gone for so long. Hmm. I killed one of yours. I killed Fergal, who claimed to be one of yours, sent to cleanse the East End of all skulls. Will his death be an issue? Do what if I bits from Dunamite? My priorities have changed. William Marshall is the first Fergal Earl of Pembroke. servant of mine, but like any servant, he had his limitations and is readily replaced if necessary. Okay, I guess we're just going to, we have no choice but to join. I agree to join the club. This is good news. Good news indeed in these crucial times. Let's inform the assembly formally and proceed with your initiation. My initiation? Fear not. Nothing fancy nor dangerous. It is just that we, the members of Ascalon, believe that tradition and custom are the backbone of this country. It's going to be kill someone. My fellow members, dear friends, please gather and welcome this Ekon as one of our own. Is he worthy? Is, Is his blood pure? 
Well, speak, Dr. Reed. In front of the most sacred blood. Any secret society that sir has a, has a chant and usually asks if your blood now. is pure, you probably shouldn't join. Will you serve and protect the crown as he did? Yes, I will. Then, young Ekon, it is time to testify with your blood. It is time to sign the Book of Allegiance. This sounds like the way you join like an anime fan club more than a vampire uh, cult. But England's traditions are the backbone of Name your nation. waifu and let her be pure. This is emo is I don't even like using the word emo anymore, but this is very emo. I'm gonna write him blood. Uh, just do my do my DeviantArt poetry. Mm, delightful. 100 bits from TJ Prime. 100,000 views. Welcome to the Ascalon Club, Doctor Reed. Take your place among the bears. Welcome to the Dai Jobu guys. One of us. One of us. They're actually doing the one of us thing. One of us. Now everyone take out your anime hug pillow with your favorite girl on it. I, I just want that to be a thing now for vampires. Vampires who are really, really into anime. This is an outrage. We shall chase these intruders down. I was chased by a gigantic Valkod two nights ago. I thought it was Fergal coming back, but no. Good evening, Dr. Dr. Reed. How does it feel to be Oh, you're that guy I met that used the cross at one point. Figuratively. Vampire anime elitists. It's quite unsettling. As so a that doctor, high school club that only has five minute members. The observer than the subject observed. Do not be alarmed. The Ascalon Club has a tried and tested. He's not a vampire. He, I guess he's like the one member of this group May that I isn't ask a vampire. Who you are, sir? Why would you be interested? Well, as you seem to be the only man in the room yep, with so a beating a heart, you draw quite a bit of attention yourself. Ah, vampire senses never cease to fascinate me. They dwarf those of mere mortals. I am Aloysius. Do you remember this video should be talking heads with appropriate music? Are you a member of the club? Yes, I am. And I have been for many years. And will be until the day I die. Are you sick? Personally, I consider my advancing years are a sickness in itself. My body is slowly abandoning me, Dr. Reed. Oh, why didn't you become a vampire? You're part of a vampire society. What can you tell me about it? It's not really my place to give you such information. I am merely a mortal member, and a dying one at that. I guess they would need humans, though. Are you not afraid? You are surrounded by vampires. Sir, it's for that very reason that I joined the club in the first place. You asked for membership? So you asked for membership. I have been a member of many clubs in many countries. But I must admit, this one is my favorite. Oh, shit. Okay. <sighs> what else do you get to tell us? It's not the nature of this club, a secret. Shared by only a privileged few. My dear Dr. Reed, I have spent years and a fortune precisely to gather that kind of information. And, yeah, I just dropped a controller, that's all. What can you tell me about Lord Redgrave? I would not dare speak of our chairman without his consent. Okay, you're famous. Mr. Dawson, of Dawson and Dawson. Of the Dawson, Dawson, and Dawson? England. It is a pleasure to meet such a prominent figure of London. A withering London figurehead, to be precise. Are you sick, Mr. Dawson? 
I am a doctor, you know. My case is beyond the scope of traditional medicine. I have spent fortunes on the world's most competent doctors to arrive at that diagnostic conclusion. I'm sorry to hear that, sir. Should I suppose that you're here in search of some form of immortality? Absolutely not. I'm here to implement my plan to save the city I was born in. To cast out the ghastly evil that has us all on our knees. This game makes you realize you're too much of an introvert to be a vampire. Well, technically, a, a vampire would be very introverted and not, you know, socialize this much. What do you know about the guard of Prewin? I should not say this, but I admire their commitment. This is what the nation needs right now. Would you help them? No. There is a time for such methods. But brute force will not be enough to fight this plague. We have to think differently. Hmm. They are our enemies. But they are our enemies. They are not mine, Dr. Reed. What is the situation like in this part of town? Whether well, that sure guy is still Lord bitching Redgrave in the background. Would enlighten you more effectively than I. Money cannot solve every problem. This mysterious epidemic is going to require more than money can buy. You're right. Money is nothing unless one has the will to wield it. I have a plan, sir. A will, will I be a vampire? You mean in real life? In Not London. sure. What is your plan, then? Quarantine and barricades are futile. What we need is a wall. A formidable unscalable wall to isolate the deserving from the infected masses it's weird i can't tell if they're just you know do, having that line because of you know current events or if it's going to be something actually in the game in the game it's hard to tell I'm get, I'm, I feel it's that line is in here because of, you know, Trump. Dang, it's inefficient. It's efficient. It's unfair. But that would segregate the rich from the poor, would it not? It would be unjust. Our only course of action must be to save England. And to save England, we have to make sacrifices. Are you not mistaking sacrifice for summary execution? Why do you care? Are you not a vampire? removed from all mortal concerns decisiveness is what the city needs and it needs it now he's a white nationalist vampire lover i personally went patrolling last that night. went well did it not and i spotted it is always useful to bolster the troops' morale, especially before a difficult battle. You have the makings of a general, my lord. I was, though very long ago, well, not quite a general, but a proud defender of the crown. So why did you really want to meet me? Straight to the point again, young Akon. All right, let's talk, you and I, Lance Sparrow. I'm listening, my lord. According to my spies, you have worked with Dr. Edgar Swansea on the epidemic. And your findings were quite alarming. Okay, where are you? Uh, uh, do you know Edward Swansea? Do you know Edgar Swansea? Not personally. But give give these vampires a MAGA sort of hat. Immortal fetish. It, it wouldn't look too out of place, so given how they're, you know, what their dialogue is like. Friend. As long as you reveal nothing of the club's inner workings, why should I forbid you engaging in conversation with the good Dr. Swansea? You are spying on me. Not personally. Make England great again. I rarely Mega. This building. Yeah, that 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 that's actually but that could work. That hat could that hat that that hat probably already exists Until actually. Put an end to his I would not be surprised. Who was Fergal? I don't see him sipping tea with the others in the club. Fergal Bansha was my squire of sorts. Even before becoming that magnificent beast, he was a brute. He served me well for decades. No, I mean, what was he? He was clearly no ordinary vampire. No, he was a Volkod. All muscles and instinct. Quite the rare breed. Ferociously territorial. 
Mortals often mistake them for werewolves. And you know I killed him. You do know I killed him. Yes. Will you bear ill will towards me for his death? Of course not. Your victory was quite impressive and courageous. You earned my respect. Yes, I'm convinced the recent invasion there are mega of frenzied mega scouts I in London figure there is directly would be. linked to the epidemic. This is not the Spanish flu, but something else. I would be glad to hear more of your discoveries, Dr. Reed. But for now, my main concern is the security of London's inhabitants, both mortal and immortal. Well, what's more what important, are there any Mooka hats? Alarmed by the epidemic, Make the United the Kingdom great Freeman again. Mooka hats, actually. Against us British Mooka. vampires. To appease the situation, we must eradicate the skulls. Some scowls are peaceful. I have met peaceful and wise scowls. To exterminate them means we are no better than vampire hunters. Scowls are hideous, shameful creatures that give all Econ a bad name. So, what do you want me to do? I want you to investigate the city thoroughly. I have reason to fear there are cases of contagion in this part of town. Our absolute priority is to find and cleanse them. And how would you like me to proceed? By all means necessary, Dr. Reed. You are now a member of the Ascalon Club and you have carte blanche. Interrogate the locals, follow all the leads you find, and get results. Oh, I didn't mean to finish Shall talking to him yet. Obscure songs around the city. Okay, Mesmerize is at level 4 now, though. Consisting malevolence. Skulls have been spotted find the infection everywhere. How is your investigation going, Dr. Reed? Time is our enemy. I have a few questions for your lordship. All right, but be quick. So William Marshall. You made me swear on the blood of William Marshall during my initiation ceremony. Why was that? William Marshall was the most glorious knight who ever lived. He served five kings and was a living example of probity for all. And he was my maker. Vampire? William Marshall was a vampire. Is this some sort of joke? Wait. Could he be my maker? That would be joyful news. Hmm. For it would mean he still walks among us. I wonder how Dracula, if Dracula is actually in this game's the lore. Knight has left this world for good. Why is his blood so sacred to the Ascalon Club? He was simply the greatest defender of the realm we have ever known. I fought by his side at the Battle of Preston. And he made me his progeny following the fight. What can you tell me about the Great Hunt? It's a major concern. And I'm convinced we'll only get a satisfactory conclusion by putting an end to the epidemic. McCullum won't stop. Oh, yeah, well, that guy we met Jeffrey once. McCullum. I'm certain he will persist until he has killed every last vampire. The guard's current successful recruitment campaign is driven by the ravenous behavior of the Skulls. I see. So without the epidemic creating Skulls, the guard could not convince anybody of our presence. Exactly. Once we have put the epidemic behind us, we need only wait until the guard grows old and weak. Time will once again become our ally. What about the risk of a full-scale attack here? Yeah, he called it make it when you, you make a when a vampire a makes a human leader. another that vampire. Exactly they call it making so a, their progeny. Basically, I'm becoming their vampire daddy. But not me. I founded this club. I'll die defending it. May I ask you about the mortal who attended my initiation, Mr. Aloysius Dawson? A member of the club does not normally ask questions about other members. We trust each other mutually. So he really is a member, then? Indeed. Only the most eminent members are allowed to attend such ceremonies. Even if I admit some of us fled during the first hours of the Great Hunt. But Mr. Dawson is mortal. Are you not afraid he might reveal who you are? Especially to your enemies. Aloysius Dawson is a man of his word, as are all of us. This is the Ascalon Club, Dr. Reed. We do not grant access to the unworthy. Alright, we gotta now go talking to the locals Goodbye, to find Lord out about the skirt, the, the skag infection. We are counting on you. Two nights ago. For some reason, they couldn't do this themselves.
We also got the basement key to this place, but I didn't see a door it would open. I think it was back outside. How come they didn't mention all these dead vampire hunters in their, in their foyer? I was thinking that would have get something out of them. What evil secret do they keep in their basement? That is going to be a hidden entrance later on. That is going to slide to the side. They're going to bring me down here. It's going to slide to the side and reveal something. There's literally nothing down here besides that obvious secret entrance to something later. Dead vampire hunters are there for aesthetic. You know, I guess vampires probably would keep corpses as like knickknacks. I guess that makes a wicked kind of sense. Welcome to the Ascalandra, then, Dr. Reed. Alright, now we talk to the locals, find out what they know about the Skags, and probably go down into the sewers once again. I think Lord Redgrave just suggested I was sired by an ancient vampire. Alright, let's ask her first. What do you know about you? She knows a lot about good vampires. Evening, Miss Ashbury. And good evening to you, Dr. Reed. Local infection. I'm investigating the source of the epidemic in this district. Have you noticed anything unusual recently? A few days ago, I spotted a strange house while campaigning for women's suffrage. Awful smell. No answer when I knocked. Where is it? It's the Mullaney's. A nice family who live in a big house near the park in the eastern part of this neighborhood. Well, that's that was pretty easy to get a lead. Goodbye, Charlotte. We literally walked out of the door and found the secret that these guys had to here. recruit She's us for to where we gotta go next. Last few nights. The answer was right out front side their front door. Right, we still have more locals we can ask, though, for more sources of information, though. But that's a big lead. Maybe the rat lady will know something. Where'd, that, where'd, where'd rat lady go? They don't trust women. Tasty rats. I'm investigating the source of the epidemic in this district. Have you noticed anything unusual recently? Infection. Infection. The rats carry it, I, I heard. Rats. 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 Many rats around that big house. She has Funny chiseled too. chiclets for Dead teeth. Flesh. And where is this house? West of the park. Not very far. A, a big house with no sound, no light, no life left. Okay, everyone's telling me about the house. Now. Goodbye, Miss Billow. That's the sewers. That's probably where this mission will end. Is anyone else confused by what that mission objective up there says? Investigate after citizen about infection. Something about that literacy throws me off. Am I wrong? What do you know? I'm investigating the source of the epidemic in this district. Can you help me? Infection is everywhere these days. But if you ever go to the park near that swanky house belonging to... How do you turn off closed captions on iPad? Yes. You should probably be able to find what a little gear the icon on the stream player. That should house? give you the option. Not enough noise for a big family with children. Not enough movement. Closed doors. What is going on in there? 
Okay, they're all telling me to go to this house. Clarence. That's all I can do. You should try to sleep. Where the hell we go? Yeah, it says investigate after a citizen about infection. That doesn't really make any sense. Ooh, there's two different houses, actually. Family, find the sources of infection in the West End, and... Okay, it's right over there. Oh, yeah, I go down this way. Oh, man, these guys are these guys are going to be tough. Why are vampire hunters sniffing around here? I need to find out what they're after. That almost killed me. <laughs> Got to be smart. It's locked, all right. This is not normal, but I'm like six or seven levels under level because I have hardly killed any of the citizens by drinking their blood. Well, at least that makes the combat challenging. When I can actually almost die. Yeah, the Inception walls play whenever you kill someone. Which house is it? I'm on the wrong street. Juicy rats. First. I think that lady is our actual soulmate. This is despicable. Why, does, why can't I just grab them one after another? Why is there like a wait before I can grab another one? It's, there's a mark right there that says the house is here. Oh, there it is. This woman's body has multiple lacerations. They're deep, too. Whoever did this was driven by rage. 
I'm preparing myself for a boss fight that's gonna just bust my chops since I'm like l under level all the other guys. His tongue removed and his eyes gouged out. He was a victim of brutal torture. I don't believe vampires can get STDs. That would be very strange. This that question seems to be coming broken. up in chat a lot during this game. He was young. Probably the son. Wow, what a terrible hair texture on that thing. <laughs> you thought I was dead too, didn't you? Oh, uh, they did the no, whole uh turn the person around in a chair slowly Don't cliche. Me, I could have been a great actress. You killed your family. They mocked my talent. <laughs> I didn't realize something was killing me. I guess I was poisoned by her, her goo or something. I thought I was like, oh, I'm kicking this lady's ass. That seemed pretty one-sided on my part. Uh, literally, her poison just slowly killed me. I, let's try that again. Really, I have to click all this shit again. Maybe I don't. Nope. Still see. Oh. This game doesn't use manual saves because you could save scum it, and it doesn't want you to do that because you the part of the game is you know making choices. So can't do it. Maybe I don't have to, like, re-get all the stuff. Nope, actually, I don't. For some reason, it was just... I missed those two the first time. All right, let's try this again. No, I'm out of blood, though. So now it'll actually be more difficult. Yeah, we've already seen your, your cutscene. Yeah, you come out of that poison cloud, please. Okay, that's getting real annoying. I would like to hit you, but you're covered in goop. Suck that blood out of you, so I can use powers again. I could just, like, kite her until my ultimate comes back. And then kill her off in one go.
this old video game dance, is it? Do the two step. I'm very impressed. Could it be a new stage in the disease's evolution? And that was what we came here for. Learn the, the disease is mutated. Dear Elsa, it's with the greatest joy that I confirm this letter. Your acceptance as a private student into my acting school. Little scene you had, the kindness performed to me. So... This girl took lessons at the famous Doris Fletcher acting school. Okay, back to the streets. We gotta go ask more locals what they think of the situation. back over there. Oh, this is new. Wrong way, though. Yeah, I'm not sending Ghost Recon. Sorry. Maybe my butler and my mom will know something. Yes, Mr. Jonathan? I try to avoid sending Sonic games, actually. I'm currently investigating sources of the epidemic in this part no, of Whitechapel town. is still here, but it's just... Know anything useful. Not still, really. Whitechapel's just a shithole, that's all it is. All the McPherson's servants resigned a few days ago. They feared becoming infected, they said. The McPhersons? Where do they live? I think it's a rich house near the railway bridge in the southern part of the district. Goodbye, Avery. Please watch over my mother until I return. Of course, Mr. Jonathan. But please return as soon as possible. Okay, we got a new one, right? Reach the second source of the infection. There's going to be a third source. It always comes in rolls of three. Dart again. Sin, you don't know Jack. And all of its sequels. door at the very least. What happened in the last stream? Uh, we killed our sister. That's basically the only real event that happened in that stream was we fought our sister and we did more talking. That's really all I can recall from it. We head up there to the right in that out. Okay, that's not Like I, like I said last night, it's actually really hard to miss anything important in this game. You can you could turn this stream off right now and go do something for an hour, and you would come back, and you'd probably see me still talking to the same person that you left the stream off on who I was talking to, or doing the same exact thing. Or it would at least look very similar to it. That building is under quarantine. Could this be what I'm looking for? 
Thank you for the thanks for the idea, Dart. See you later. Thank you for the 200 bits, Flynn. You, you, Flynn, you can still leave the, the stream on your tab. Just mute it that way. It's an extra viewer on the thing. Helps me go up the Twitch charts a bit. Maybe find some new viewers as well. Just on the down low. Ill-formed, dazzled skull. Oh, sh oh, sh Hello, big sir. Something that big and menacing should make a cute little whimper sound when you hit it. the worst movie I've ever seen, the Super Mario Brothers movie. I think that's actually considered one of the worst movies ever made. fight the same mutant lady again here, aren't we? Or is someone similar to it? I thought for a second I'd got completely turned around and just it just feels like it that's so strange okay, that's where I came from though That statue felt like it was a collectible I could break open or something. It's in the suite of life of Zack and Cody. I have no idea what that even is. Remarkable pump action shotgun. Sure, I'll check that out. It's technically better than my other shotgun. Once you once I level it up to max level, I suppose. It's two of them this time. Oh, 
Can you nail that? Poison. Get out of the poison. <laughs> Stop the teleporting. Okay, that's the second source of infection down. And we still have to gather more information about a third source. Send my YouTube channel. I feel that's actually kind of cliche at this point. Thank you for the precious perfume and the fur coat. I can't wait to feel your hands on my shivering skin. For only you, my hero, can make me feel that desired. Please come back. Let me, let me read this properly. Please come back to me soon, for I am dying to press my timid bosom to your chest again. Yes, my beloved, my precious, come back to me, and I promise you a night of eternal and unbridled passion. Right now, I'm wearing nothing but your last gifts. Oh yes, I'm burning for you, and I can't wait for you to share my untamable lust. Your devoted Doris Fletcher. So the husband had enough. The hot in here is it just me? Fletcher. Most romantic thing I've ever read. My stream's gonna be banned now for that much smut on this stream. <laughs> Narrate 50 Shades of Grey. It might improve it, you never know. Doris Fletcher seems to be the missing link here. It can't just be a coincidence. I should go to her acting school. Locate Doris Fletcher. Give me that blood. I don't like the explodo zombies. I mean, explodo vampires. They sadden me. I, should, I, I, I could get a job reading erotic fan fiction that people write. That might work. That's where Dolores, Doris Fletcher is the source of the epidemic. He's over there. So to get there, I can just go down here and across to it. Sin God. I like that nickname. Raven's bits. 100 bits from Matthew, or is it from Raven? That The, the next line kind of confused me. Please don't say a line like, her lip is redder than the Communist Manifesto. Now here's a better way. I'll tell you what, that woman's lip, she's there redder than a Communist flag, man. That, there's how you read that book. Odaba104, thank you for being a fan of the channel, dude. Hope you're enjoying yourself. Alright, right up the road. I, I don't know why, but I saw I, I want someone to read the entirety of the of the of the Fifty Shades of Grey in that really southern scooterish voice now. I want you to take me in your playroom and punish me, dude. Come on. Something like that.
Is that your playroom, man? Is where you keep your Xbox? I said it. Stay away, sir. There's one of them. Watch yourselves. Send the real god. Uh, hard to do. All right, into the theater we go. Say, catch a ride, catch a ride. I can't do that guy's voice for I some reason. Enter. Yeah, we got to go into a side alley, probably. Catch a ride. It's it's like it starts out low, then it gets high, high on the eye. It's like, catch a ride or something like that. I really don't like border memes the game though, so that's probably why I don't really care about doing voices from it. How do we get inside this place? It's locked, all right. I like how the objective is just find an access, find an access to the theater. But oh, really, you don't say. I cannot enter. That's completely the wrong direction. One thing I can think of doing is going around this side and maybe finding something back here. I really need to go to a safe house soon. I've got a ton of experience points. Is there one nearby? There is one over there that I can use. Also one up here. goes back to Whitechapel. This can't be right. We'll go level up, though. We need to. You can't just smash your way through anything in this game, unfortunately. We got a thick, rich blood sample. They give us strong blood serum. Oh, those are useless. Oh wait, I should check and see if I can upgrade anything. Nope, still I don't have any aluminum parts. Eighty damage. That's pretty good. Holy God, this thing's gonna do so much freak! Oh man, I need rivets. This thing is gonna do six hundred over six hundred damage per shot now.
Let's level up too. This should get us to level 22. All right. Uh, I really want to level up my claws. Oh, three now. So that's going to do really good damage. Could level up my ultimate as well. I think I will. I want damage right now. I don't need. Ex I don't really seem like I need health and everything else. But we're at level 23 now. Oh, good. Very good. Well, everyone got sick while I was sleeping. Thankfully, it's nothing but fatigue, though. Now I just need to find out how the hell do I get into that theater. Thinking it might. It has to be in that area over there. That's the only thing. It's it has to be in somewhere inside the circle, so it's obviously not up this street or that. So it has to be somewhere, either in this area right here in the alcove or on this little tiny street over there. Oh, that gun! That gun is going to save me so much trouble with enemies. be down there somewhere. Go have fun with Doom though, Freddy. Did not mean to do that. That was a good waste of blood magic. Tell Dex you said hi, if she comes in here at any point. Okay, this looks like it might get me. Yeah, this There's gets me into the theater. Window on the second floor. I should be able to get in through that. Here we go. Suicide note, I can't stand the pain anymore. It's like my entire body is breaking apart since that bitch infected me. For days now, she keeps hiding in her room, giving orders through little written notes, and only rehearsing at night. 
I witness one of her so-called rehearsals. She walks on stage, angry and hateful, spitting and whining about her fading beauty. The bitch is infected, wow dude, language, brought into the core, and she plans to infect everyone in this place. And then everyone in London. Her next play is not before December, and at this time, all the theater's employees will be her obedient minions. Forced to serve her evil machinations, I'm sure she found her found a way to corrupt, corrupt our food or the water, since we all started to get ill and change after the meal she arranged for us last Monday. I want whoever finds this note to know that I only killed myself to escape the living hell that this place has become. May God have mercy on me and my immortal soul, since I refuse to be accompanied to this devilry. This game has been edgy since the beginning. It's not getting edgier by the minute. Woe to you, nations of hypocrites. For in front of you stands the tall queen. You can but lower your head. Can that be Doris Fletcher's voice? Hmm. This could be interesting. Where does it come from? Let's not let our hopes get too high, though. The game has disappointed us every single time. We thought it was about to get good. They keep doing that. Oh, she looks fancy. Alas, poor Doris. I knew her well. And many can testify to her kindness and beauty. For now, she hides in shadow, ugly at sin. But when you burn Get ready for a die, boss fight that is going to kick my ass. And be queen again. Shakespeare irony. Yeah, it doesn't really make much sense for her to be quoting Shakespeare. Other than, you know, standard villain thing to do. Big exception. Put on another show. Woe to you, nations of hypocrites. For in front of you stands the tall queen. You can but lower your head. Fit only to got one hell of a hunchback, it looks like. Peach. Next, you know, they'll be quanting Dante's that, Inferno. Dante's Inferno isn't really a play, forest. it's a poem. It's kind of hard to even turn that into a play. I have this thirst for blood. It's locked. Let's check that other room first. Now this lady is a vampire. This isn't the same lady you're thinking of in the in the hospital. door is finally oh shit well it... oh, please let this door now be unlocked I didn't think it would actually send me back outside okay good 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 just have to get loading ourselves again 
Normally the game has pretty short load times, but every once in a while they get long. I cannot enter. I'm beginning to see the theme of this game's design. Just put as many barriers of locked doors as possible in front of the player and have them go the long way around. That's not it. Wait, was the way I need to go again? Time sink? Exactly. Here we go. Who are you? You who dared enter my realm. Are you here to worship or mock me? I'm here to put an end to the vampire epidemic, Miss Fletcher. Ah. But Doris Fletcher is no more. She was consumed by this putrid Does she have a shoulder baby by any chance? Her. You feel anger for what happened to you. But I can help you. I'm a doctor, Miss Fletcher. Doris Fletcher is no more. That's gotta be a shoulder baby. All that remains are the dreams of the queen she was. And the queen she'll be. Until then. Shall die for that was her final wish. My blood, my children, my beloved. Oh, shit, I don't like that. Oh, she's a Resident Evil boss, actually. Give her the ultimate. Okay, that wasn't that bad. Uh, wait. I beg you, wait. What? I... I don't want to die. And I did not come to kill you, Miss Fletcher. Will you spare me then? Save this cadaverous carcass of mine. Does your heart beat a little faster now? You fancy me then, Doctor? No, Miss Fletcher. My dead heart will beat for only one. Ah! Is she pretty? Is she sweet and tender? To me, yes. Ah, I hate her. Ah, I know. Ah, ah, this is partly that's the sound she makes. Must be destroyed. But you just said that I did not come here to kill you. Yes, but I realize now the threat you embody must be stopped. <gasps> How does she walk without being like be tilted to the that? left? Will you? You were Doris Fletcher, the greatest actress of her generation. No one can take that from you. Thank you. And farewell. I wonder if this is purposely made to be hokey. Farewell, Doris. Bravo! So dramatic. I love it. McCullum. How strange I seem to find you whenever I'm inquiring about that skull infestation. I mean you no harm. I'm not here for you. But once I've put all the pieces of the puzzle together, I'm sure we'll have a little chat, you and me. 
Stay away from me, McCullum. You and all your war dogs. That I can't guarantee, Dr. Reed. But I'll let you go. For now. Hmm. That was... What a strange mission design this game relies on. the theater right now. It's locked. Oh, the door I came through is now locked. Okay. The West End should be safe now. But London is not. It would be wise to benefit from the Ascalon's protection while I continue my research during the Great Hunt. Why escape? He said he's letting me go. Yeah, the wording of the mission is a little weird, isn't it? Count him out. I think I'm safe. So Doris just needed to be close to her audience to infect them. Contagion through skin. Very disturbing. So we have two mission objectives, actually. We'll first report to Lord Redgrave, though. Where he be? Across the river. Oh, yay, this is another one of those places where you can't act, it's just a dead end. Too many of those. Where's the actual way at? This way. How dare you interfere with my foot? Are these things fucking lay off. Okay, we're almost there now. Oh, save! Oh shit! I like ran right past someone who needs saving. Save the exhausted oh, shit. Let's do that, or he'll die. Oh, let's let these guys find out. I don't need to worry about that. Okay now. I swear you're okay. Is someone here? Weird. That has that's him, right? Yeah, that's right there. Maybe it's because these enemies still are still alive. This is now my domain, young Echon. Ow. Okay, maybe that'll give this guy reset. I'm Dr. Jonathan Reed. Do you need help, sir? I think I'm fine. But what happened to my jailer? Be careful. He's as vicious as he is strong. You don't have to worry about him anymore. What happened here? I am Tadao Kimura. I was imprisoned by this lunatic for several days. I thought I was going to die here. You're not going to die now, Mr. Kimura. If you hurry, you should be able to get home safely. 
It seems that I owe you my life. You have all my gratitude, Dr. Reed, since it is the most precious thing I possess. Goodbye, right. Mr. Kimura. Good job, Take us. Care. Let's continue all we actually need to do. Was he Japanese? I'm not entirely sure. I didn't call anyone daddy. That's chat that's saying daddy for some reason. This is around the time the chat turns into a, gr a bunch of degenerates and starts making the weirdest jokes possible. It's kind of like clockwork actually. Elizabeth, what are you doing here? I've been formally asked to witness your triumph, my dear. After all, isn't it the natural role of a woman to support her man in victory? But it's you who insisted I join the Ascalon. Please forgive my giddiness. I'm just overcome by the thrill of finally being allowed within these hallowed halls. You certainly have an inquisitive mind. It's quite something. Elizabeth Ashbury. Only you can make me smile in these difficult times. And the same to you, Jonathan Reed. Now go have your little chat with the chairman. I can see he's practically bursting to hear your report. And <laughs> that was on a fanboy's bucket list. There's probably a, that's probably a very long, much longer list than any of you suspect. They must have spent years preparing their plan. This romance between these two is, feels a bit forced. Welcome back to the I'm looking at this Club dark window that's era. painted black. Please tell us the good news. Have you put an end to the epidemic? My hypothesis was correct. Doris Fletcher was the source of the contagion in this part of town. Is she this worth the sixty dollars? No, infected. no, it and isn't. You cleansed her before the hunters, I've been told. Well done, Doctor Reed. You thrust your lance and pierced the very heart of the corruption. Whoa, there! You don't have to make it sound dirty. I just set fire to her. That's all I did. But some questions remain. The important thing is we won a major battle for the survival of London. For that, we salute you. Thank you, my lord. Now, I have another task for you. One of This the is an RPG, imports. after all. Perhaps even more so than the previous. I'm listening. It's time for you to perform a most sacred duty for the club. I want you to recruit a new vampire. Recruit a new vampire? Are you sending me on some sort of diplomatic mission? Not exactly. I want you to make Aloysius Dawson the Ekon he deserves to be. I'm not sure who? That old guy? I'm not sure I'm the best candidate for such a task. I can hear the hesitation in your voice, Dr. Reed. I admire a man of principles. But in this matter, there is more at stake than your moral comfort. It's not a moral question, Lord Redgrave. It's the responsibility of giving immortality to a man I barely know. Nonsense. Aloysius has been a member of the Ascalon for years. This is but the fruition of a long-held plan. How would you like me to proceed? Aloysius is waiting for you at the Dawson Estate. Once the deed is done, I'll join you there to celebrate this momentous occasion. This feels like a setup. Before I go, I have a how few How have I been questions. doing? Pretty well. All right. How have you, how have you been listening. doing, Samurai? Why Aloysius Dawson? Because he is about to die. And he just may be the most influential man in England. After me, of course. Does he know I'm coming? He can't wait to become your progeny, Dr. Reed. Especially now that you have shown how strong your lineage is through your sister. Did he choose me? No, I did. My decision is very recent, to say the least. 
about to We're about to become a vampire mine. daddy, apparently. How would you like me to proceed? Don't worry. Aloysius has had many years to prepare himself. He has studied our kind for decades. The lines don't match up with the poor facial expressions. It's mainly because they're so robotic looking. Mass Effect Andromeda had better, more of captivating facial animation in this game. This game, everything, this game actually feels like it's about 10 years old at this point. So shall I just let him drink my blood? Yes. Aloysius will gratefully sup on your blood. His heart will slow, then stop. But he will rise again as one of us, an immortal. Is there any danger? Our blood alters a mortal body so deeply that some don't survive the metamorphosis. They die for good. But Mr. Dawson has been preparing himself for a long time. You invited Lady Ashbury. Wouldn't that be breaking one of your cardinal rules? No women allowed. Not allowed as members, no. But considering the circumstances, I thought you'd like to have her here to witness your triumph. So it's a temporary admittance, then. Something of a bargain, considering the crisis we're currently facing. Goodbye, Lord Redgrave. So, we gotta go make a vampire little guy. I think we're safe for now. I pursued a kid. Zykeba, you're tired as fuck. You should probably you go, right, go to bed, dude. Jonathan? Lord Redgrave has just ordered me to turn Aloysius Dawson. To make him my progeny. I see. And how do you feel about this? I'd like your advice. I'd like your advice on the matter. The real question here is, why has his lordship given you this task? Do you think it's some sort of trap? Do you really want to know what I think about this? I do, yes. To make an immortal of a soulless blackguard like Aloysius Dawson will only lead to a disaster for London. The man is already dead inside. Should I refuse? Perhaps politely suggest that Lord Redgrave turn the man into a vampire himself. Don't 645 bits from Base Clef. Apologies for the lateness. According How goes being a friendly neighborhood vampire? Better than the last couple nights. Could kill you for even broaching the subject. Really? Why? I've recently Far less talking. found proof that the Earl of Bristol is of lesser lineage and only capable of creating skulls. Hmm? Please, tell me more about your recent investigation. As long as you lower your voice. About Lord Aloysius Dawson. What would you have me do about Dawson? The man is dangerous. Did you know he plans to build a wall to separate the healthy rich from the sickly poor? Do not Yeah, that's so totally a reference to modern times in do? Trump. The man's dying already. Let the reaper harvest the rotten fruit Vampires want to build that wall, guys. Soul. Are you sure your information about Redgrave is correct? He says he's the progeny of the great knight William Marshall, who lived some nine centuries ago. That's a lie. Lord Redgrave is unable to create anything but skulls, if the poor soul survive at all. How can you be so sure? How can you be sure the information was correct? I made the acquaintance of a most interesting informer while investigating your maker, from whom I learned the truth about Lord Redgrave. Why so vindictive? You suddenly sound like you're angry. Forgive me, Jonathan. I hate myself for it, but I feel such pride in my discovery. I'm afraid I just can't help it. Which is? He did serve William Marshall. And yes, the blood he covets as a token does truly belong to that legendary knight. But he was never his progeny. His lineage is not so noble. Okay, so that guy's lying about being the progeny of William Marshall. What would happen if I made Dawson an Ekon like myself? You would add a powerful immortal into a suffering world. An immortal who already craves authority. Maybe I could teach him control. Like you taught me. Lead him down the right path. Mr. Dawson spent his life searching for a way to cheat death. I'm sure he has spent decades dreaming of how he'd spend eternity as a tyrant. 
Goodbye for now, Elizabeth. Goodbye, my dear. I'm like we got a big choice coming up. Be careful. First, I'm gonna go use the restroom and get something to drink, and I will be right back, guys. Don't go anywhere. Pretend, you guys in chat, pretend you're vampires and have really long conversations with each other while I'm gone. So, how many vampire chats do we have in chat? I agree, TJ. I love this chat, too. You guys are an awesome group. Alright, time to go either kill or make this guy a vampire. Hushed Casket. Thank you for your Twitch Prime sub, you Halo-quoting dude, you. Make sure you use Hush Casket. Make sure you use those emotes you just bought in chat. And feel free to tell yourself, introduce yourself to the chat, tell us about yourself, or say some really funny joke you just have on your mind all night long. <clears throat> Alright, so, where we left off. Time to go kill, or probably kill this guy. I, I doubt we'll actually have a choice. This doesn't seem to be a game where you have choices beyond uh, the regular NPCs on who you get to kill. So much pressure. Oh, that's not that much pressure. Well, we could, we could, you know, for new subs, we could do reenact the 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 trial they had in here, where you had to like swear yourself, write your name in blood. And put your hand on an urn containing it sacred like vampires night have to ashes. Obey Mendel's laws when producing progeny. Powers pass from one generation to another. That's why Dawson wants me to sire him. Testify with your blood. There's oh, this dude's all the way up here by that place. There's a... Let's go save. I, I have enough for another XP level. My dear, bring me my glasses. I feel like reading. Get your own damn glasses, Mom. Okay, we're good on everything else. Uh, more, I think we'll spend these on health and stamina, maybe? 
Maybe not. What else do we have? sure what I want. Holy god, that costs a lot. Actually, I should probably upgrade my autography. Autophagy. Autophagy? However that's pronounced. I have to be careful saying that. There we go. More blood and more healing. I have not bought any of the defensive abilities because they sound like they suck. I wish I could take this one back too. I've never used it once. Face clap. See you later and have a great time at dinner. Well, this place is in good shape now that we got rid of the infection. What time am I streaming to? Probably about 11.45. outside my house. Damn, this is right outside the back door of my fancy mansion. Go this way. wanted me to come to his house but it's locked okay we got to go around wait oh no it's over there never mind i should find another way to get into the neighborhood find a way to access Aloysius dawson's man find a passage to get... okay there's one here somewhere I guess it'll be somewhere near the water. It'll be like a sewer crate or something. Set of shotgun shells, so I need to swap swap weapons. I need to swap weapons, Douglas. There are furries in chat. When were there furries in chat? And why am I only just now informed? I think this passage could lead me close to Aloysius Dawson's mansion. Big sturdy stools, I mean blood sample. Thirty. 
Give me my ultimate. Okay, I can deal with level 30s. That's good to know. I'm not prepared. Okay, yellow and storm rage. This guy is literally expecting me to show up at his house and turn him into a vampire, but he's making me go through an underground chamber to get to him. Come to my home and turn me into one of the immortal undead. But, you know, the, the roads are a bit, a bit... The traffic's a bitch, so go this long way around. Don't have to go through the dungeons, I'm afraid. And maybe a detour into the sewer system. What are you doing, Dex? Meowing? Yeah, you want attention. Stop ignoring your pleas for love? I am ignoring zero pleas for love. You are now receiving my telepathic messages of love. I'm Shaggy. Wow, watch how fast the lighting engine turns off. I've never actually heard of feeding uh, ferrets live mice before. Usually they, there's like specially prepared food for those, aren't there? No one can hide from Ascalon. Oh. Listen to the ch Wait a minute. Listen to how different this this sound this the soundtrack to this fight sounds to all the other music in the game just because they had a big black guy show up. It's all of a sudden it's like and everything else has been like mournful violin music. It's like subtle game, real subtle. Repeat, repeat, boss fights, boss fights. Give him an ultimate. No one. He's a tough one. He's a level thirty two. I need another ultimate to bring him down. Or just one good place pillar. I need to back off. I have no stamina. Oh shit, get away. I am part of Ascalon. Why are you fighting me?
that was random. This guy works for the same people I do. And he just attacked me for no reason. That was a test, my boy. I Don't worry, there's only two more boss fights to go before you get to me and turn me into a vampire. I'll be waiting. You keep hearing crunch, crunch? That might be me going slurp, slurp, actually, on my soda. Sorry about that. I usually don't like eating noises to go onto the stream, but it's right next to the mic. went in a circle. My name is Robert Te Teasdale. Whoever may find this message, please try to help me. My daughter Lewis disappeared a few weeks ago. She has been seen for the last time in a bar in the neighborhood, not the one where she works as a waitress, but another one. The Dancing Trout. Two witnesses saw her leave the place with an elegant and unknown man, maybe a foreigner. There are, ma there are many rumors of men and women vanishing in the area. I am convinced my Lewis has been abducted and is being kept somewhere nearby. I know the police will not, hel not help. Where they are, please search for that. So like a Lewis's side mission. Lewis's father yep. was determined to find and save her. Side mission. Ready, welcome back. No. This is not the game for puzzles. These two switches do the exact same thing. Okay, we'll put them there. That apparently worked. Well, we are trying to become a blood daddy. We're still trying to get into his place. Oh, where did they... What? God. That was random. They came out of nowhere. Our steak. We need to drain some blood. help me by any chance.
I guess I just gotta find the right level and then go down to that level. Oh, wrong one. Anything at all. Oh, thank God, brats. I can't believe I'm doing this. Time for a meal. This is despicable. You should be totally used to this by now. I can't believe I'm doing this. This is despicable. One more. Oh, that's that lady. This first for blood. That's the Lewis. Well, kind of spoiled that she was down here. How do I get to her though? This way. Kind of tough. How long are you gonna <laughs> Just using him sliding. He was silver surfing his way over to me. How do you know my name? Who are you? My name is Dr. Reed. I managed to track you down thanks to your father. So my father really was looking after me. This man... He's dead, though. This vampire told me my father was dead. He is. Is it true? I'm afraid so, miss. I'm so sorry for your loss. But you are free to go, as your abductor is no more. I suppose my jailer also killed my father, didn't he? Thankfully, he did not search your father's corpse where I found his notes describing where he might find you. You should read them. I must find my father's body. He deserves a proper burial. Later Goodbye, then. Miss Teasdale. And be careful. Until we meet again. You should return no, no. to... No, no. I want to grab the Goodbye, box. Goodbye, Miss Teasdale. And... Going up now, that's right. Oh, common axe. I haven't got a new weapon in a long time. Uh, it would take some leveling up before it would be any good. Please tell me we're out of this freaking sewer level. Yes, it seems we are. Hmm. 
No rocket launcher? Not exactly. Just shotties and pistols and clubs. And machetes. That's pretty much all you get. You can get an ability to let you make people explode, though. I guess you could consider that a rocket launcher of sorts. Alright, here we are. Let's unlock this door so we never have to go through that again. That was so... Dim we could have jumped, oh, climbed over this wooden fence. We had to go around all of that because that was too much of a barrier. For a lord of the night. I am the ultimate hunter of mortal men. But wooden doors, it scare me. Good evening, sir. May I ask you what you're doing here at this late hour? Maybe it's just solid oak. Investigation about the Maybe it's blessed in this part of town. And you can't just you, climb over to blessed from the Pembroke Hospital. May I ask who you are? And why are all the questions? I'm Detective Inspector Charles Albright from Scotland Yard. I honestly expected him to say, I'm Sherlock Holmes for a second when he said Inspector. What is a Pembroke Be the wrong year timeline for that, though. This time of night. I work for the Ascalon Club. Here is my permit to go freely about the city. The Ascalon Club? You should have said so, sir. I must warn you, these streets are dangerous. And you'd better be careful. Do you know anything in particular about a man called Aloysius Dawson? Who doesn't know the man? I think he intervened personally to put an end to the police strike of last August. What else can you tell me about him? Aloysius Dawson is exactly the kind of power. I can enter any place I want with, with or without permission. With it, with just one That's not call. part of this vampire lore in this, in this game. What are you investigating exactly? I have a missing woman, possibly abducted a few nights ago. Louise Teasdale. It seems you already found my other missing person, Mr. Tadao Kimura. Tell me about Louise Teasdale. She's a waitress. Her father reported her missing. We don't have enough men. I'm to Shaggy. For Hope, her, have a good night, dude. Do you have any idea where she could be? No. But I feel she's been abducted. She went to a pub a few nights ago and vanished. I thought about the sewers, but I'm not equipped. For such an investigation. I'm in London. What are you really doing here? I told you. I'm a detective inspector from Scotland Yard, investigating suspicious cases in the area. What about the situation in the East End? Why are there the, no the police? The detective there looks to like he want to be popping civilians. and squatting know, in the street behind shame, him we real just bad. Don't have enough men to cover the entire city. That is like the most English sentence I have ever heard. He looks like he want to pop a squat on the street. I had to stop and think alone. about what that yes. meant for a second. The situation is difficult for the police. Many of us are sick, and since the summer strike, most men apply a work to rule on their patrols. What can you tell me about this district? I'm the one asking questions, especially when there's a killer on the loose. What killer? I'm not going to discuss that with the civilians, sir. Haven't I told you about the investigation I'm conducting? Perhaps I could help you. All right, without giving you too much information, I'll tell you this. I'm convinced there is a homicidal maniac on the loose. Wait. Using the epidemic to disguise his Do killers. not do Jack the Ripper. Do not do it. Don't go there. It's too cliche. And what about the epidemic? We both know the situation is critical, don't we, Doctor? Colleagues of mine die almost every day. Why are you investigating at night? Criminals rarely act in daylight, you know. Well, I sin but Doom. What exactly could I work? sin in it? Here's Have Doom Guy, here's Robot Guy making Doom Guy kill demons. Attention? That's the plot. No. I've noticed nothing odd. All right. But keep your eyes open, though. Tell me all you know about that homicidal maniac you're looking for. I'm not even sure there is only one. The wounds are always the same, but the modus operandi varies. Sometimes violent and brutal, 
sometimes precise and swift. How could different killers inflict the same wounds? That's my main problem. If my theory is correct, maybe we're facing a group of individuals sharing the same violent tendencies. Perhaps a sagist cult. Okay, yeah, we've talked to this Goodbye, guy enough. Detective Inspector Albright. Goodbye, Dr. Jonathan Reed. I'm sure we'll talk again soon. I certainly hope not. I actually could put on a trill a trilby a trilby hat, because I got that as a part of the uh, pre-order bonus for this game. It's a different coat and a hat. But I really don't like it myself. Seems a bit too pretentious. What did I just walk into? Oh, we have tarot cards. Never lie, but they are it's never locked, easy all right. To read. Jonathan Reed, at last we meet. The cards warned me you would visit tonight. I beg your pardon, sir. Do I know you? Of course you do. Our mutual friend, Dr. Swansea, can't speak highly enough of you. My name is Usher. Usher Talltree. You are the leader of the Brotherhood, are you not? Primate of the Brotherhood of St. Paul's Stoll, to be precise. I'm really glad we met tonight. I love it when the cards tell me a truth. The cards told you to expect me? Yes, they tell me everything. They told me that you struggle hard not to take too many lives. I'm really into Yu-Gi-Oh! Is there anything you could tell me about Aloysius Dawson? Aloysius Dawson? Yes, of course. We met on several occasions. With time, he got deeper and deeper into the occult. He's not the only one. It's been quite the fashion for several decades. The Golden Dawn, for instance, is just one example. True. Aloysius was a member of the Golden Dawn until 1900. Then his thirst for dark knowledge grew. I'm talking forbidden texts, readings which blackened his heart. He saw the Blade movie. He was never the same since... Could you read cards Can you for me? Read the cards for me. Are you sure you want to know what they will reveal? Yes, I am. It will cost you 150 shillings. Holy... Screw that! Perhaps later. What can you tell me about the neighborhood? I really don't 150 know. shillings? For a card reading? What a ripoff. And when I do, it's usually to quite distant destinations. So you see nothing in the stars for me. You're a poor fortune teller, then. Oh, I can tell you many things, but they will only concern you, not the a city. A shilling wasn't very much, was it? For example, I know that you offered your sister the final rest she asked for. He's Indian, obviously. Do the cards speak of my Mary? No. It's the burning Summon Celtic Guardian in attack mode. Precedes you everywhere you go. Read my fortune. You have been chosen, Jonathan. I see on you the mark of a strong being, so powerful it needn't even reveal its strength. Tell me about yourself. What do you do here, besides turning cards in the middle of the night? I'm for most a charlatan. For a few, I'm a vampire. Not at those prices. And for you, I'm the primate of St. Paul's Stole.
For how long have you been a primate? He just it sits in a tomb all day years. doing card Last tricks. Year. What do you make of Dr. Swansea? Make Edgar a good living doing is that. A brilliant and dedicated man. A man of his time. Sometimes a little muddled, but always looking for new paths and new concepts. Some believe you to be a vampire. Who? Do you know what Pot of Greed does? Who else? For time we have some real Yu-Gi-Oh fans in chat. Activities, and they even broke into my home to gather proof. Did they steal anything from you? A personal notebook they quickly took to their headquarters. All they had to do is to look at me. I'm aging. What better and definite proof that I'm not an immortal? Do you want your notebook back? If you ever find it, I'd be glad to have it back, of course. I do ask one thing, though. Do not read it, Jonathan. Some secrets are not meant to be revealed, even to immortals. Uh, How there we do go. You measure the amount of blood on oh, we were done talking to him. I told you. The cards always tell the truth. I haven't watched Little Karibo's parody in a long time, actually. Is it possible he stopped doing it for a while, and I kind of forgot about it, but I guess he came back to doing it. more delicate to read, Doctor. But I can try. No, Dickian, thank you for the five viewers, dude. All right. Let or me no, Dickian, I mean. The walls of your prison have already been raised, Jonathan. But you will freely accept to be locked inside, full of hope for a better day. Goodbye, sir. Until we meet again. I rarely wander, yet it amuses me to converse with your kind. A red river, a yeah, we'll dark, leave you to your dank tomb the under the city. Okay, we have a safe house we can use, and we can go talk to this guy and turn him into a vampire, or be betrayed by him, either way. This is Gotta eat that rat belly, though. How does Infinity Plus 1 work? It doesn't, it's just a kid's way of saying... It's just a child's way of saying more than Infinity. Because once someone calls Infinity... They've technically won, but children have this unique way of altering reality and to, to like create terms that are meaningless and still, you know, continue the argument. So, uh, uh, infinity plus one, infinity plus a million. Children are well known for their reality building, reality build, bending powers. Sometimes when I've been streaming for a long time, I start to remind myself of that South Park character that can't speak. Building powers. We have a ton of health supplies now. Okay, we can get to level 25 too. What do we want? Balls cost 3,000. Can't get those. That's too well, we could get another upgrade to that, but I really don't want to. Uh, screw it. We'll get some more health. And we can't get any more stamina. Yep.
It's all we can level up for now. Alright, we're level 25. This, di this district is in really good shape. I should definitely eat people here. Alright, down the stairs, up the building, turn the dude into a vampire. Let's go. We've made this take way longer than it should. It's one of them. Shit, wait, where did I... I came in on the wrong side of that door. Crawl back to the house. Where the fuck am I? Oh god, I'm on the wrong... Oh, shit. All right, now I have to kill them. Let's go through the right way. Strange and incoherent about everything. So much violence. New characters. Yay. I'm Dr. That's what I wanted. Can I be of assistance? Dr. Reed? Dr. Reed? Is there anything wrong? No, it's just... Your name sounds familiar. And your face. Have we met before? I think I would remember. So I suppose the answer is no. That's odd. I'm certain I've already heard of you. Just think of this, guys. This My is pretty is much Perrigan the last Bailey. of all the lengthy talking sections we have to I'm do with all these NPCs so. on the street. But it's a pleasure to meet you anyway. We've basically mm. met all the characters the in the game at this point. The pleasure is mine, I guess. I only wish I could remember when it was that we met. What can you tell me about Aloysius Dawson? I've heard this is a man who has searched for his place in the world for a long time. I hope he found it. I don't care Goodbye, about you. Mr. Baker. I just need to introduce you. I introduce you. These guys are twins, aren't they? Good evening, sir. I am Dr. Jonathan Reed. Do you need my help? Yes, please. Would you be kind enough to tell me what the time is? That's all you need to know. Well, is it not important to know? As important as where you are, or who you I'm are, very confused. I suppose you're right. And who are you then, sir? I am Agamemnon Baker. Like my brother, I think we need to leave this city immediately. Will I send Assassin's Creed I Syndicate Jack the Ripper? No. Anything. What can you tell me about Aloysius Dawson? You should ask that question. These two to my are the exact instead. same character, just with Personally, slightly different I've seen clothes. For many years. One has a tie and a jacket, the other has an actual suit. Goodbye for now, Mr. Baker. Where's the door to this freaking place? goes down to that guy's secret little tomb so we don't go down there. Does this guy have a front door on his mansion or what? lock his gate when he wants me to come to him why is he making this so difficult 
Like, we've already had to go through one entire detour to get to this district, and now his gate to his mansion is locked. I'm very confused. Where could the entrance to this place possibly freaking be at this point? I'm making my angry face right now because this is starting to get on my nerves. You would think when the mission is go to this guy who's waiting for you, it wouldn't be that hard to get to him. Locked, all right. no, I'm at a loss. I have no idea where he could be at this how to get to him at this point. Maybe I missed something down in that tomb room. He's down there's an entrance down there. Nice and all, but what does it do? This has to be the way in, but it's not there's no rhyme or reason to that puzzle. The fool and the Empress again. Shut up, you the cards trying to tell us. Buys. Maybe I have to buy the freaking reading from him. Good evening. Which one? Where's the How thing where I get the? the maybe I gotta have him read my, my fortune. Hands. I told you, the cards always tell the truth. Well, most of the time. Is it possible to tell me my future? The vampire's fate is much more delicate to read, Doctor. But I can try. Not it. How did you learn about Mary? And spare me the hocus pocus parlor tricks. The truth now. Swansea told me. Don't look at me like that. His task is to observe and gather information about vampires. He had to tell me about Mary. Mary did not deserve her fate. She had already suffered enough during her life. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And yet the pain and the suffering went on after her death. Suffering is part of the immortal condition. Some prefer to lose their minds rather than face the simple truth. Pain will never stop. There's the... Read the cards for me. Can you read the cards for me? Put the money on the table then, Jonathan. And open your mind. Here is the money. The sorceress. Well, you didn't even animate it, they? Trap built to entangle a loved one. Mirrors on every wall to see her own reflection constantly. That did nothing. Goodbye, sir. Until we meet again. I rarely wander. Yet it's amusing. Mm -hmm. The only there, this has to be the way into this guy's mansion. Whatever these things do, there has to be like a certain. I've st There's no clue though to how you st what order you stand on them. I make any sound effect when you stand on them. I saw, I saw a marker behind this wall for a second. So dumb. 
I guess we just gotta keep asking Weston and to be able to get inside, we just have to keep asking people about the uh, Aloysius Dawson. That's the only way in. For some stupid reason, they want to pad the time more. All right, what do you know about the dude? Hello. I've already asked you. Goodbye for now, Mr. Baker. Too many murders. Good evening. To investigate them all. I've already asked you too. Goodbye, Mr. Baker. I've asked you. Doctor. There is no one here Goodbye, left to ask. Detective game. Inspector Albright. Goodbye, Doctor Jonathan. This is really sure we'll getting on again, my nerves. Sir. There is no reason I have to keep asking people about the guy. He's right there. Fine, let's go ask Carol. Carol Price is deep underground. We'll ask her about it. Now that's back in a freaking dungeon. What do you know about the dude? Please tell me, inform me. Good evening, Miss Price. Dr. Rick, Always too long indeed. And as a token of my appreciation, I'll grant you the best price if you fancy buying anything from my humble shop. This dude. Do you know Aloysius Dawson? Everybody knows him. He's only been to my shop once, though, looking for rare books and other intriguing antiques. Did he buy something from you? No, he left quickly. He almost laughed at me. Rash the Great, welcome, dude. Mr. Dawson may be a rich man, but you you're can't here just in time to see me getting incredibly but isn't annoyed. Aloysius Dawson known for his philanthropy? That was before his brother Robert died in an aeroplane crash. Since then, the remaining twin has turned into a heartless tycoon. All right, we found out something new about a Dawson dude. What do you have to sell? May I look at you? It's always a. Uh, I don't have much money left after I. I do need these though. Buy both. Are good for upgrades. I hope you can stay a little longer this time. Good evening. Dr. Reed. Yes, of course, you are the doctor who healed me and my mum. Good evening, Dr. Reed. Good to see you too. Wow, you are Carol. really low texture are resolution. Right? Oh, yes. I, I did not hurt myself recently. I know how to take care of myself now. I'm almost a grown up. Have you ever met the famous Aloysius Dawson? Yes. A very strange man. Not very nice. What do you mean? He said he was ready to pay good money for rare books. And then laughed at what we showed him. I hope you can stay a little longer. Ugh. Goodbye, Carol. I don't care about the rest of your nonsense. Good morning. Uh, Who else good is here? Evening, sir. It's locked. I'm just trying to rush to get into this guy's house. Okay. This guy's house now. Is there anyone less left to talk to? Will I rage quit? I don't see why I would. I kind of want to get past this guy's house before I finish tonight. The game isn't making it easy, though, is it? There's no one left down this way. Yeah, this is enemy territory. Yeah, his door is locked. He wants me to show up here and turn him into a vampire, but he will not open his fucking door. All, but they will not be forgotten. I Does anyone enter. know how to get in this guy's place? I don't care. If you know, please tell me in chat. I'm so sick of this already. I've reached the end of my rope. No, we haven't beaten the game yet, unfortunately. But I'm getting very irritated at the, at the, the nonsense that's throwing up in my path. What chapter is this? This is... Ch We're on chapter 5. We're trying to get inside uh, Lois's Dawson's mansion. Doc 
to... You know anything you useful? Well, I would... Why do I still have the feeling that you're hiding something? What about the abductor? Was it the same person? I don't think so. You had better interview Miss Teasdale and Mr. Kimura on that matter. All I did was to lead them safely home. Goodbye, Detective Inspector Albright. I've, I've Goodbye, literally, the only thing Jonathan I can find Green. is some switches on the ground that don't I'm seem sure to do we'll anything. And there's again, no clues sir. to how to get them to, to what order to do them in. Everything else is just a brick wall in this place. And it's really getting on my nerves. This is really bad design. And it's already made me go through one entire hassle to get here. Anything in my dial out journal list? There's not even a freaking journal in this game. I forgot about that nonsense. Uh, no, I don't think EBT cards are for poor people. What, what is an EBT card? See, I've done every objective. It just says, enter Aloysius Dawson's mansion, but his only door is locked. Minecraft has better voice acting in this game. I guess so. Wait, where's my mission marker at now? What the? You're confused? It says the mission should have been completed. Well, this mission is to get inside this guy's mansion. We've already... And we had to go through the sewers to get here. But now the mission marker on his, on his mansion is gone. What the fuck? Now there's not even a, there's no mission marker on the map now. What the what the hell's going on? Enter Aloysius Dawson's mansion. Okay, let me turn the game off and turn it back on. It might have bugged out somehow. This better not be some kind of game-breaking bug, though. Oh, buddy, it better not be that. Let's go to sleep and see if this fixes it, maybe? I don't know. No, I haven't been invited inside. He's expecting me. I'm so confused. What does it want me to do? See, there's supposed to be a main quest marker with this Y on it. But there's no Y anywhere on the map. This is his, this is, should be the entrance, I guess. This is the gate. It's locked, all right. No, there's actually no door there, so I guess this isn't the gate. There's actually no door to his entire mansion. There's just like this weird, creepy little tomb down below that I can't get inside of. The little path at the top of the map? Where? I, I have no idea. Where on, on this map? You said it's in Whitechapel? A little path?
there is no other gate that I'm seeing. Northwest of the west in white. You guys are really bad at giving directions. All right, this is Whitechapel right here. You're saying northwest, which would be right here. So you're saying to go over this way. It's still weird that there's no marker pointing me that way, though. So go inside the hideout, go over here, and it's over that way somewhere. This has been a stupidly designed mission, to say the least. I think we can all agree on that. I've been dicking around for 20 minutes trying to find a way into this place because this was where the, the original marker was at and now there's no marker on my map. See, I don't have an objective marker anymore. After leaving the sewer, head through the hideout and find the Dawson Mansion to the other side of it. Head inside and make your decision. Okay, I, mean, I don't want to read the rest of that because the rest of that sounds like a spoiler. Stay back, beast. Just fuck off, all of you. I'm in like a really super pissy mood now. Is this it? This must be it. It has to be. Why was there no objective marker, though? That's so bizarre. That threw me off completely that there was no objective marker to where this guy's mansion was. Dawson's mansion. Here I am at last. Follow Lord Redgrave's orders or Elizabeth's advice. Am I ready to make a dying man my progeny? 100 bits from Matthew. Woot! So we have t we have a choice here. We can, we can either not turn this guy into a vampire, or we can follow Elizabeth, or we can turn him into a vampire. That's our choice. Elizabeth seems like the nicer of the, the two people, so maybe we should follow what she wants to do. I don't know, I, I, that, that was just really annoying, how the, the marker didn't appear where it should have. I feel that that's what threw me off completely. I thought it was in that area, and that's why I kept looking around there. Reduced in rank for falsely accusing a man of murder. I wonder what Inspector Albright thinks about his punishment. miss me wandering around stupidly for 20 minutes because the game didn't tell me where to go. And now we're gonna probably kill an old man. Finally you're here, Dr. Reed. What took you so long? I had to pass several of your barricades and outposts to access your mansion, sir. Death, pestilence surround us, and time is against me. I see you've gathered some of the most expensive, albeit experimental, blood transfusion equipment available. 
All this could be so useful in a hospital. Yes, yes. Since Lord Redgrave sent me a doctor to perform my conversion, I thought you might find some of these devices useful. Most thoughtful. But tonight I'm not here as a physician. But I feel reassured that a specialist such as yourself would help me to escape the Reaper. Very well. But before I proceed, I have a few questions for you. If you must, but be quick, for I don't have much time left in this life. First of all, I need to be sure that you know exactly what is going to happen to you, sir. I can assure you I'm as informed as any man can be. I have planned for this moment, Dr. Reed. Planned very carefully. Why didn't you do it when you were a young man? Trust me. Believe me, there is a huge difference between reading about vampires and waking up as one. I learned that myself the hard way. Oh my god, man, stop your whining. I don't have time for your pointless jibber jabber. But becoming my progeny. I will become your maker. Do you understand what that means? Well, I certainly won't consider you my liege or some such drivel. You can be assured of that. You're not really making this easy on yourself. You'll need to feed on warm blood. Blood from mortals. How do you feel about that? I'm rich, Dr. Reed, and powerful. I'm sure I'll be able to acquire all the blood I need without ever having to sully my own hands. Wow, it's like he's asking me to kill him. What do you know about the guard of Prewen? What I do know is that I'll crush anyone or anything that would dare to oppose me. Well, at least he's an honest psychopath. Let's move on then. Please, I'm cold and tired. I feel my life waning with every moment. But first, before you embrace immortality, what would you do with such a gift? That's a rather impertinent question, Dr. Reed. And I will do as I please. Answer me all the same. What will your first action be as an immortal? Out with a to save no London. Labra. I will finance the most efficient quarantine ever seen. I will build a wall that will separate the sick boroughs from the healthy ones. It's gonna build that wall, y'all. Oh. Why, well, they keep repeating that so often. Who gave you the right to decide the fate of thousands of people? My money. My money and my pending immortality gives me the needed authority, Doctor. I'm a This guy doesn't know much about subtlety, does he? Merc this old motherfucker. You really plan to build a quarantine wall across London? Yes, it will be tall and strong, separating the wheat from the chaff. Break two separate prisons then. By doing so, you will also create two separate prisons. Come, sir. An eminent doctor like yourself knows that such radical measures have proved efficient in the past. Let me guess. You mean to isolate the rich from the poor. This is a desperate measure for desperate times. England must prevail, Doctor, no matter the cost. How much is this? How many guys worth 2,000 XP only? Shit, that's not much at all. Quarantine is not a bad idea, medically speaking, but I'm convinced this epidemic will not be contained by mere walls. As long as the right people are on the right side of the wall, that's all that matters. They're like giving this guy every opportunity to hang himself. But you can't guarantee infection will not spread. Just one contagious carrier would be enough to create an apocalypse. The apocalypse is already knocking at the gate. Uh, to donate less than they 100 bits, you just type in now. a smaller amount of bits. What if a new outbreak happens inside your walls? You'll have created a giant trap. That won't happen. As long as we dispose of anyone that is contaminated as soon as they are spotted. I've heard enough. I've heard enough. It's time to proceed. At last. All right, do what you have to do. If it hurts, so be it. 
I've been preparing such a long time for this. Earn your sacrifice. 2,000 XP in the prospect. All right, so you won't grant... All right, we can kill him, we can charm him, or we can turn him. Turning him turns into a vampire, but we lose out on 2,000 experience. Embracing means we'll get 2,000 experience from him, but we'll probably piss off... Uh, yeah, probably piss off the club we just joined. Or we can charm, he'll still die, but we won't gain the experience, but we'll probably... Won't uh, piss off our, our, our friends. Oh, I'm not turning him into a vampire. Fuck that guy. He pissed me off way too much to get here. If Yeah, I think it's going to have to be Charm. If we kill him, we'll probably be, get on the bad side of our... Of the, the vampire club we're in, which I don't really want to do just yet. Hmm. Listen to me, Aloysius Dawson. You will forget your fear of dying, for it has poisoned your mind and made you bitter and ruthless since the death of your twin brother. You don't understand. Death is oblivion, the eternal void. I know there's nothing there. I saw it in Robert's empty eyes. I saw myself in that coffin. Death is painful for those who remain, not for those who have passed. All that occult gibberish you filled your head with has made you forget this simple truth. No! Death will not claim me. I have the power and the money. I've acquired the arcane knowledge needed. I believe there is magic. There are dark forces. You will provide me my extension. Your ignorance makes you a fool. You have no idea. Look at me, hunted like a beast, my family lost, cursed. I have not escaped death, I have become it. No, there must be a way. I don't want to go like my brother did. I have money, lots of money. Money won't money. mind. I know you used to be a good and generous man. So I offer you the gift of peace, Aloysius. The tranquility of a true death. I accept your offer. And I understand. No more fear. I well, he turned around quick, didn't he? Dignity, and a man at peace. Our mesmerized level is at level five. The district will soon suffer the consequences of your actions. The dude who's apparently a terrible SOB, his death will make this place a worse place. It's locked. All right, we made our choice. Uncle Scrooge will die a natural death. Uh oh. Is it done, Dr. Reed? Is Aloysius Dawson reborn as expected? I'm afraid Mr. Dawson finally chose to embrace life and death as a mortal. What do you mean? He has overcome his fear of dying. I let him rest and wait for death to come. What? This is unacceptable. Go back there and make him the powerful Econ he's destined to be. No, Lord Redgrave. As a doctor and as an immortal, I can't. If you wish to make him your progeny, then proceed on your own. This is an outrage beyond words. This is betrayal, pure and simple. I should kill you on the spot. You swore on William Marshall's blood. Well, get rid of me then. From now on, you're an outcast. Well, Banished. I tried. You are forbidden to ever appear in front of us again. Ascalon will smite you on sight, and your heart will be thrown to the rats. I'll leave you then. Have fun with your puppets and shadow plays, Lord Redgrave. Yes, go, traitor, and take that awful creature, that counterfeit of a woman I saw waiting for you, and be gone! 
Protect the Pembroke Hospital. Oh, he's going to attack the hospital? Well, killing... I'm pretty sure killing him and letting him... And, and doing that give you the same... Do the same thing. In fact, I wouldn't be surprised if all three options end the same. He probably like betrays you once you turn that guy into the into a vampire. Oh, it's you. We meet again at the strangest of times, young Econ. So do you serve the Earl of Bristol now? Old Bridget. What are you doing here? Your friend, the wise Econ. She sent me to warn you. How did you meet her? I miss Far Cry 5. How did you meet I don't. Lady Ashbury? She came to us in the sewers in search of answers. Just as you did. What kind of answers? What kind of answers did you give her? I knew nothing of your maker, but we talked. We talked a lot. Her words and ideas are captivating. It is no surprise that you like her. I like her too. Lady Ashbury in the sewers? Now that's a sight I wish I'd seen. She said she was your friend, and that she sought the identity of your maker. If you made him a so vampire, it leads to a boss questions. fight, so he turns into a vampire and you have to fight him? Did anyone see you? It's a long way from the dock sewers, and hunters are patrolling the streets here. Who said I took the streets? How do you think I survived for centuries in this city without ever being seen? I know all her secrets. Lady Ashbury. So he dies no matter what choice you make, essentially. Tell me what's going on. The lady approached me but a few nights ago, wanting to meet the sewer skulls. Once she questioned Harriet Jones, she agreed to help us. Harriet Jones is still with you then? How is she doing? Harriet remains angry, but is recovering slowly. Her mind is twisted, but at least her body is healing. Tell me what is going on. The lady asked us to keep an eye on your mortal doctor friend while you were away. We spotted the hunters. They were discussing plans to attack tonight. Wait, slow down. I need to ask you something. I'm listening. So where that but vampire hunter is going to attack waste. the freaking so be quick. hospital? Where's Lady Ashburn? Where is Lady Ashbury right now? She said she will go home. She needed to speak with some old friends first, though. Do not worry, young Econ. She is no fool, and just as strong as you. I, did, I already know that. Why do I feel like Lord Redgrave was particularly irritated to see you? Far more so than the average skull, if I may say. Because I used to know him quite well. And he is afraid I may remember who Oh, he, he really made her. Is. He's her sire. You're Elizabeth's informant. You're the one who told her about Lord Redgrave's lies regarding his lineage. Yes. But my words were not meant to hurt or threaten. I simply told the story of the sewer skulls. And of so many other forgotten children. Uh, I would not describe this game as either of those two things, Avioli. How did Elizabeth find you? She presented herself. Who is this again? She's like this. This is the sewer lady, the sewer skag. She's like a failed vampire. In London. She asked about Ascalon. She asked about many things. What do you think of her? Her soul is good, yet tainted with a deep sadness and the scars of ancient wounds. Time does that to us immortals, for we have so much to dwell upon. Why did she come to you? I am old Bridget, the buried memory of the city. She sought the silent truths, truths I have kept hidden for so long. All right, we got to go save the hospital. No time to lose then. I must go there right away. I shall return to my den. Have you a message for the lady? Should I see her before you? Uh, tell her I love her. Yes. Tell her I love her. Is this still unknown to her? 
Go now and take care, young Ekon, for the flames are rising. Hmm. All right, let's start a new recording. Let's go save the hospital. How? Ooh, we got a long way to go. All right, we cut across here and go all the way through Whitechapel, and we'll be there. Tell her to wax before I return. You're a true romantic. You really thought you could betray Lord Red Oh! Lord Finney! Oh, he 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 mad. That did nothing to him. Stop it with the shadow bunch, shadow cocky bunch and shit. Damn it. This game takes place supposedly in historical London. No, there's no fast travel in this game. The, honestly, the map isn't that big, but there, it still kind of gets annoying. Maybe this will work this time. No, he resists it. Fuck. Give me the blood. That stuff hurts a lot. Say you like it. Oh, this is really heal. Need stamina. Got him. Oh, no more of them, please. All right. I'm guessing we'll have to fight multiple of them on the way back, though. Okay, we're in Whitechapel. Okay, I can probably sleep and get my stuff back, because I am weak. I don't have your money. Come on, Barrett, you know the game. You pay for peace of mind. Can't you just look the other way this week, Joe? Come on, we can sort it out. I need to buy something from you too, don't I? You? No, the wrong guy. Goodbye, Mr. Peterson. You got handle parts. Give them. Hand them over. Fancy buying something? You never... Right then. Alright, he's got good stuff. Uh, I need handle parts. Oh, that stuff's so expensive though. Maybe I... Oh, actually, I think I need aluminum. That should be good. Not oh, wrong, freaking God! Where's my Good safe house? Harry. No, May I don't I want inside. Is there Damn it! Any pain and suffering in this world. Yeah, continue to suffer. Why is it always so hard to find anything in this place? It should be down this way.
There it is. All of Whitechapel looks like an opium den. What are you talking about? This game, yeah, it's starting to get aggravating. Well, it's been kind of aggravating from the beginning, but in the past hour, it's gotten extra aggra aggravating. What do I have experienced to upgrade? Uh, nope. Well, I could get more health. Yeah, sure, more health. More s no, we don't have enough for more stamina. Stronger bite, sure. We're gonna go to the, the we're gonna save the hospital and we're gonna call it that there for the night. Death of Aloysius Dawson, a highly respected resident of the city district, passed away last night. Aloysius Dawson, co-founder of the head of, head of the Dawson and Dawson Company, at 71 years of age, he was no secret that Mr. Dawson's health was had recently declined. The once joyful businessman had almost totally disappeared from social events since the tragic death of his twin brother. An influential man, Aloysius Dawson, was also a great art collector, and you know, he's a really great guy. That no one knew anything about his real self. So that's that district's going to go down now. Actually, it didn't go down at all. No one cared about him. Still healthy. Good. He also loved cats. I need, I need blood. I can't believe I'm doing this. Oh, I came back for someone, some loving cats. Did I miss anything in the last few hours since I walked off? Uh, I'm not sure. We, we let an old man die because he was a bastard. And now we're going to go save a hospital full of sick people. But first I have to chase some rats to get my blood built back up. I have this thirst for blood. This is despicable. I can't believe anything I'm catch my doing eye at the electronic this. arts. Uh, that one game where you have like a little uh, child and a bunch of monsters and you're selling a boat looked interesting. Uh, other than that, hmm, not a lot. I don't really care about Anthem. This way into the side. Yeah, Sea of Solitude, that's the name. That was probably the only real game that looked interesting to me. Surely you guys were riveted by the Madden video where the guy, the champ Madden champion, came in and introduced a new Madden. And then there was that, you know, Command and Conquer on mobile. Good times ahead, my friends. Are you from Ascalon? I don't care! Much further. Command and Conquer nearly destroyed your soul. Well, 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 Oh, sh show me how you. Ow, 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 ow. God, dude, lay off. guys are a right pain in the ass. Everyone 
with all the blood I went together. All right, we're back at the hospital, though. What is this truck? Are the vampire hunters here already? Everything seems to be normal. Having fun yet? Well, let's see if we find fun in the next 10 minutes. Those bastards. What have they done to Edgar? Took him. Looks like he's wounded. I better follow the blood. Blood leads kind of right there, though. Oh, finally upstairs. We finally go see what's up here. Battle on the rooftop, guys. Let's see if this game can pull it off. This is supposed to, the battle on the rooftop is supposed to be like your epic fight. You only get to do it once. In your game. That's a massive boss arena. Oh, they have UV lights. Ultraviolet curtains and ori calcum powder. Dr. Swansea's always been a resourceful bastard. I bet he never told you he had this installed in case of a vampire attack. Says a lot about how much he trusts you. What have you done with Edgar? Don't worry. We don't kill humans. Even if your friend is deserving of a little punishment for what you do. What are you talking about? We know everything. Swansea and you created this bloody epidemic. You aim to unleash another disaster just like William Marshall did. No, I'm trying to put an end to it. Just like you are. You're in progeny, aren't you? Where is the monster hiding? It's still in England, isn't it? I have no idea what you're talking about. Jeffrey, please listen to me. No tricks. That shit won't work on me. We found proof. I'm a the stubborn when I am. Doris Fletcher was your first experiment. Now where is Marshall? Speak. That guy's got guts. Guts his weapon from you know on his arm. An auto crossbow. <laughs> so much for modern technology. Time for the tried and true. Do you know what this is, beast? This is a drop of King Arthur's blood. The blood of a true what? defender of Britain. Stronger than your evil King powers. Arthur's blood. This is ridiculous. We're losing precious time. True enough. Soon I'll bring your head before your coward of a father. He's got Excalibur and he's got King Arthur's blood. Try something else. Oh, he's got spotlights for light, too. Oh. Ah, this is kind of annoying. Your poisonous bite is useless on me. I can't, I can't regenerate stamina. Fuck me. Maybe I should equip a gun for that fight. Yeah. 
Yeah, let's let's equip a gun. Try this again. Put you down. Bring that blood back. Oh shit! Lay off. I know. It hurts. Show some style. Fight like a man. <laughs> Can you shoot the gun, please, dude? Oh, he's got health as well. This is really annoying. Let's give him my ultimate. Oh, the freaking light. It hurts, doesn't it? Ow, 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 ow. Oh. God, really? There went all of my freaking serums, too. Because those don't respawn with you, because this game is stupid. Now, the lights go on and off periodically, sporadically. They just don't stay on. There, yeah, all my blood serums I just use are gone. I don't know why it does that. That's Show such a stupid fire. thing. Fire like a man. Also, the ammo, if I use that up, I'm screwed. Well, I'm dead. <laughs> well, I, I think I'm dead. This bite is useless on me. Oh, that does so much damage. I wish I could attack the lights. What put you down? God, that does so much damage. Oh, this is not a game that needed boss fights. Not with this combat system. Go Greg Sandini on his ass. Reed. 
Try something else. This is gonna hurt. The blood of a true defender of this land will protect me. Your poisonous bite is useless. Get out the sun. Reload. Oh, thank you. That I love how this game you can just. Oh god. So bad. Everything is so bad. You guys, you cannot move. This I I cannot tell you how frustrating the combat in this game is. The stun, there's like locks and stun locks, and then when there isn't stun locks, because enemies just come right out of it most of the time, and you're locked into your animations all the time. And then when you respawn, you'll respawn with all the health items you made. I could go make some more, but actually I can't. Or I can. We'll keep trying it like this first, though. Come on, just to get better at fighting him. Try something else. We wailed on in there for a while. Not that it matters. Just... But if you're so innocent, why does simple night burn you so much? Show some style. Fight like a man. I love the stamina system in this game as well. Hmm. Hmm. Frustration, my old friend. I almost had him dead that one time, though. That's my guiding light. Yeah, they wanted to be Bloodborne with their stamina bar. The thing is, none of the other enemies in the game have stamina. So they can attack you as much as they like. Your poisonous bite is useless on me. <clears throat> He's got over a thousand HP, I think. Well, there goes all my health. Can't re I'm dead. Kill me. Here, I'll do it for you. Oh, I can tell you I'm being very sarcastic right now. I have an idea. I got an idea. I'm sure he'll sit up there and wait for me for a while. Four thousand two hundred fifty XP. Sorry, old lady. Where's she at? Good evening, Nurse Brannigan. Good evening, Doctor. Mm -hmm. oh, 
your death will not be in vain. This is the creepy lady who kept staring at us, too. This is for the best. She's old. She's already lived a full life. She has really creepy vision. And she's worth a lot of it. She's full of a lot of juicy blood. I'm doing this to save the doctor. You understand, right? This isn't wrong. sick of the poor Dr. Tippets. There we go. If you drink, well, to drink his blood, I have to stun him first. Which is easier said than done. Where's my, I gotta go to my room first. Also need to make vials of healing healing goo and blood goo. There we go. I upgrade my weapons any further. Let's do that too. No, I'm still missing aluminum parts. Fuck. Need more rivets, too. Let's level up. All right. More health? More health. Max health. We have max health. Get some more syringes we can hold. Put bullets. There we go. Level 28 now. Hopefully this will do it. Oh, the place is still fine. If we have to, we'll eat him next. We will kill everyone in this place if we have to, to, to save it. Yeah, I'm out of shotgun rounds, so this is pointless to even have that equipped. Where's my blood? My blood serum. Needs of the many outweigh the needs of the few. Exactly. If I have to, I will eat more. We will we will just swole up on the blood of rivers of blood of the innocent will flow just so this guy can die.
Well, that was a weird spawn. Bite his ass. I know. It hurts, doesn't it? Come on, Reed. Try something else. Can you? All those things hurt so much. Show some style. Fight like a man. Come on, let me generate some stamina. Stop shooting at me. Can't even attack him until I get that. The blood of a true defender of this land will protect ah. me. Oh, stop that. If you're so innocent, I didn't I need blood. Let's get my stamina back up and ultimate ult his ass. Close your eyes. No, you close yours. Oh, get out of the sun. Oh, come on, give me some stamina. I can't do anything. I get my ultimate again, I can kill him. Oh. I need you to attack somewhere where there's not tons of sunlight. It's really annoying. Heal. Heal. No, I'm out of stamina. I'm doing. I'm dead. I'm so dead. <sighs> Fuck you. Fuck you and your boss fights game. That is so horseshit. <sighs> I'm gonna run out of uh, ingredients for making potions. All right. Let's kill again. We'll be back in just a minute. You hold tight. Yeah, there's no check. If you use items during a fight and respawn, they don't respawn with you. It's dumb. The bullets and all all the bullets and tonics, if you use them up during a fight and you have to respawn, gone. That guy doesn't sell stuff anymore to me. He's dead. He's he's dead. He's dead to me. I already killed his girlfriend. He's next. And then we'll get ourselves some more stamina. Where's he at? There he is. You want to see your girlfriend again, right? Hello. Hello. I actually feel like a villain right now, charging myself up to fight the hero. This is what it must have felt like for Kefka, who was killing all those ma all those all the uh, espers before you know in Final Fantasy VI.
game hasn't changed me. It just brought out my true self. Sacrifice the weak. Look, I've spent the entire game resisting killing people as much as I can. The game is basically forcing it at my hand at this point. Yeah, that's real sad Bloody music. Monster. Did you kill my paper too? Yep, sure did. I should have known. Got some good parts for it. I can upgrade one of my weapons, maybe. Sweet. Should have killed him a long time ago. Look at all the items I'm getting. Everything that was in his store is now mine. Fuck it, since we're evil, we need a more evil outfit. The Trilby of Evil. Mm -mm. Witness true terror. All right. I make two. Go ahead and make all three of these. That's all I can do. Can I upgrade this by any chance? No, I still need more aluminum. Need another rivet. Whatever, let's sleep, level up, and go fight again. Uh, we need stamina, right? That's what's really hurting us. It's only a 15% increase. Whatever. I guess it'll ho hopefully be enough. Yes, yes, so sad. Alright, let's try this again. I just want to be able to yell to this guy, I'm back, I've killed the lives of many innocents. Face me. I now have my trilby on. I think we're good. He dies tonight. God, it's 11.58. Please let this, let this be the end of it. Poisonous bite is useless on me. You're not exactly a Belmont, after all. Show some style. Fight like a man. That's the thing, that's the hard thing about him, is he doesn't let you re regenerate stamina because he shoots at you. Come on, Reed. Try something else. True light will cleanse you. What 
pin you down. I need stamina. Okay, that was not a, 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 a human cannot lunge like that game. Now the sunlight. The he just healed himself. I forgot he does that. Come on, ultimate. I know. It hurts, doesn't it? I don't want to cast my ultimate while he's in the sunlight, though. On. Yeah, the light. Your poisonous bite is useless on me. Come on, I just got him stunned. I should just hold off until my ultimate appears. True light will cleanse you. Come on, Reed. Try something else. I didn't get my blood back. I believe it. It's almost ult ultimate time. Come on, stamina. Build up stamina, please. I know. Fuck it, I'll build up stamina while ult summoning the. Oh, he did that. Right. Finally, eat it. Oh, you don't have any idea how many innocent people I killed to kill you. Prewin shall prevail. You can't accept the fact we're not enemies, can you? We always have been, and we always will be. Of all the evils that threaten mankind, your kind are the worst. What is a man? A petty little pile of secrets. could collaborate I'm not saying we could be friends you and I but perhaps we could collaborate to put an end to this epidemic never we are pre-win we do not negotiate we do not compromise there is no way you'll ever let me be McCollum you'll always hunt me down won't you there is no escape leech kill me now for there is no way you can sway me to your ideals That's where you're mistaken. What do you mean? He's not even worth a thousand XP. I can make him a vampire or I could spare him. I'm gonna spare him. He fought honorably. I, I've come to respect my foe. I've killed enough already today. I'll spare you, McCollum. I'll offer you the mercy you never offered me. What is this ruse? This is no ruse, McCullum. This is me letting you go. After all, you and I are both trying to save this poor country in our own way. You like my hat? I'll kill you, Reed. Next time we meet, I'll end you. See? Progress already. You called me by my name. Until the next time. Goodbye, Hunter. See, I'm not I haven't completely fallen to the dark side, guys. I can still spare my enemies. Yeah, I think the hat was what caused my victory as well.
this district has gone to shit because I killed one of the head nurses and the guy who sold you know parts. my office. He wants us to go back to the Doris Fletcher Theater. Strange. Get out of these evil clothes. It's too much power. I'm a, I'm a, I'll become a vegan vampire again. All right, I'll work my way back up to it. Oh, back, we're a good, we're a good guy again. See, we have normal clothes. Four thousand experience. Hmm. Uh, we'll do one more point of stamina, I suppose. Use some more blood capacity as well. Do just enough for it. We're almost at level 30. District status is sincere. This was a healthy district until I came back. All right, guys. I think I'm gonna to have to call it there for the night. You can't really, you can't really end a stream better than what we just did there. I don't believe. Plus, it's like past midnight, so I'm getting kind of tired. I will be back tomorrow. I will be streaming probably about 9 p.m. Eastern time tomorrow, though. So it won't be quite as early as it has been the last couple nights. So I hope to see you guys back here tomorrow, and hopefully we can beat the game. That's my plan for tomorrow. Beat this game. We have to be close to the ending by now. Uh, thank you to those who donated bits tonight. Thank you to those who subbed and resubscribed. Thank you for your patronage. Thank you to my mods for doing an excellent job as always. And thank you to each and every one of you for showing up and just spending an awesome time in chat with me. You guys are an awesome audience. I will see you tomorrow. Later.